All right, recording has begun. So we are here to do a RNG run. If you haven't seen one of those, we randomized just about everything. Haven't done one of these in a few years. And part of this is how I just used to play RimWorld, but uh, we did some of these after Ideology and we ended up not finishing them. We did quite a few of them and they can get really chaotic. So what is an RNG run? It's where you randomize everything that the game lets you randomize in the game. So we'll be doing a random seed, a random map, random pawns, and random ideology which and and so when i first was doing the rng runs when we get a random ideology if they were really bad ones i would ignore them and take the mood penalty but this time we are going to adhere to whatever it is so like you know whatever whatever we roll with a random ideology we're gonna have to uh we're gonna have to do um so in order to avoid as many just restarts from Crazy Naked Brutality, like Naked Brutality Sea Ice or something like that. We're going to do Crash Landed uh, and then randomize out from there. Tree Connection, Nature Privacy. There's so many things. There's so many things. All right. So, uh, yeah, here we go. New Colony. Crash Landed. You can also do this, and I might do this at some point, but let me show you how crazy this is. Uh, you can also randomize Scenario, which I'm not doing this one. Going Canuck, welcome in. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for watching over on YouTube. Uh, welcome. Uh, Thank you Your for the five months. You can also go into scenario editor and you can hit randomize. I'll show you why I'm not doing this. Uh, <laughs> you can get all kinds of crazy things in here, like starting with 35 pawns that are age 120. Uh, we're not gonna do that this time, but maybe we'll do one of those too, where we randomize scenario. That'd be, that'd be really interesting. I did, I tested one of those. Um, I was like, I wonder what all this can roll. And I, I clicked one of those last night when I was testing. And there was like a um, um, a world destroyer in three days or something. <laughs> so it's like, what? Yeah. Uh, finish with the waves. All the VODs. Yeah, that was a that was a fun run. Thank you for watching this. So anyway, we're uh, we're just going to crash landed, and Randy Random because he's the king of random, right? Randy Random, of course. Uh, we're doing no pause, commitment mode. We're gonna put this to losing is fun and bump it up to five hundred percent, which is the highest difficulty you can do in the base game. And everything else we're leaving as default. Everything else. All right. First things first, we are going to use a little bit bigger world map. And we're going to see... Our modest fellowship expands. Uh, Sir Kells, Praise thank you for the subscription. Thank you, Sir Kells. Brand new sub. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right. We're going to hit randomize seed and go with whatever the first world seed is. Here we go. Travelers. Okay, let's see what Travelers looks like. What does our world look like? Oh, it looks like a typical world with a vulture sea, of course. Uh, this world has a lot of desert. Uh-oh. 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 All right. Here we go. Let's see what RNG has for us. Random map. We go to the very first one, no matter what it is. 3060 Boral Forest. Ugh. 3060 Boral Forest. We just barely missed Temperate. Uh, we got some potential trade people around. It's a flat map, marble slate, granite. Uh, pretty cold map. 3060. Uh, growing season is from September to April Mary. Could have been worse. Could have been better. All right. Now here's where it gets really crazy. This is brutal. This can be really brutal. All right, we're doing fixed. Here we go. Uh, so we're not gonna randomize in here. We're gonna also randomize our our precepts. So we're not just randomizing memes. That would that would be preposterous. No, no. We're going to randomize everything. So just to give a real quick, um overview we could do things like have weapons be melee only again i've done ice sheet yes ice sheet is boring not as boring as sea ice but they're both boring it's been a long time people ask me about it all the time it's been a long time but yeah i don't i don't maybe i'll do one eventually but they're pretty boring it randomizes it all that's why i go to the screen that's what i was just explaining like you hit randomize all it randomizes the memes and the presets not just one or the other all right 
Yes, I've done Extreme Desert. I think that I think all the those maps were back when I was doing one run of each map back in like 1.0 or something. All right, so um, we are going to hit randomize all until we have three to four memes because we want we want it to have the most as possible. So we're gonna hit randomize all, and the first three, the first ideology that has either three or four memes, we're going with it. My sheet is like 20 hours, one person researching. Yep. Here we go. Nope. Uh, okay. So that's actually a really good role. Let's see what happened down here, though. This, hang on. Slavery, honorable. So we have to have slaves. If we don't have slaves, we're unhappy. We are required to execute prisoners uh, at least every 30 days. Love insect meat, high mining yields, no organ harvest. Cannibalism is horrible. All these don't care. Corpses are ugly. Cannibalism horrible. That sucks. Um, believe our okay. So we know that diversity of thoughts neutral. Scarification horrible. Research normal at least. Tired. And here's where it might get crazy. Let's see what we got. A <laughs> crackhead. <laughs> so we are getting rid of the um the required clothing. I put that in the rules too that we could do that. No, do you see this? We got supremacist and it didn't give us shooting specialist. We have free love mining specialist, the crackhead. No shooting specialist. That's unfortunate. Rituals. We have a funeral, a party. Party is for. Uh, let's see. Nearby faction goodwill. We had the gladiator duel which is for insect jelly buildings. Okay, we got Neil pillows and a logo relics. Hey, we got we got a decent relic. All right, here's maybe the pain. Ranged light, noble, despised, ranged heavy. Uh oh, hang on, despised. Let me go through this list. Salt rifles are not on there, okay. So they like revolvers, auto pistols, machine pistols, short bows, recurve bows, charge rifles, and flame bows. Maybe we'll actually go, maybe we'll actually go on charge rifles for Simon forever. So they don't like using incendiary launchers, smoke launchers, EMP launchers, heavy SMG, LMG, sniper rifle, minigun, triple rocket, all the different rockets. Um, okay, so we can use assault rifles, but uh, we might actually do a charge rifle. Odds that this run makes is charge rifles, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, all right, we got pretty lucky, to be honest with you. We got pretty lucky. So. I was actually thinking we would get something far worse, like blindness or something. But it could still get worse. Harry ended last Sunday or Saturday. No. So here's the thing. Oh, this is painful. So we actually hit random once on each of these. I don't want to re-roll these. <laughs> There's, these are technically random rolls, but that's not what we do. Uh, we could do any non-archites -arch and hit roll there. All right, let's do it. We can't do random genetics, but... Here we go. Oh, this is going to suck. What if we get like three genies? <laughs> uh, all right. Let me get the names up. This might be several runs. We might lose this one pretty quickly. All right. The naming queue. Uh, there we go. Let's load it up. All right. Randomize. Base liner. 14, so a little young. Nudist in a cold weather environment. Kind, good with animals. They can get good at construction. Not great, not terrible. Nudist in 3060 <laughs> winter. Kind of, kind of not great. But uh, 14 also kind of not great, but... All right. Medieval DLC? Or do you mean royalty? There's no medieval DLC. All right, here we go. 
Oh, let me get the name. Gribbly. Gribbly. Royalty? I think royalty, it's smaller than the ODLCs, but side casting alone makes it really worth it. Yeah, I, I like royalty overall. All right, here we go. Number two. Uh, a waster. An incapable of violence waster? Why do you even exist? And they're 81. <laughs> Why do you even exist? Why are you even real? Oh my God. Incapable of violence waster. Addicted to drugs, they'll die without it. Destruction, mining, plants. Uh, cataracts, 81 friggin' years old. Okay. Fast learner. Yeah, they better learn really fast because they're going to be in the grave pretty soon. So, <laughs> you will don't got a lot of time. Die, master. All right, here we go. Last one. East Linder, kind, tortured artist. Tortured artist without, with art. They're pregnant already? Oh, Christ. <laughs> so we got Gribbly, kind nudist. We have, let's see, we have good shooting. Uh, we have okay construction and mining. One good plants. We have no doctors, guys. No doctors, no cooking. Hopefully that baby comes out with some cooking skills. I don't know. Start with a drug they need like that. Yes, yeah, they do. They do. All right. You know what? Let's uh, let's just go ahead and just hit randomize on all these. Just so like a lot of these you will get offered through quests and stuff. I'm not really going to look at these ones very much, but we might as well just do it. Delicate, super immune, psychopath. There we go. Uh, hey, you sit. Hey, you're watching those. All right, here we go. So what is our priority? We're on 3060 growing, Boral Forest, with some not great pawns. Um, Maligno is probably going to die. I, I doubt Maligno is going to survive the first winter. We got to get ready for a baby already. So we got to get a lot of food and we got to get ready for a baby. And we don't know the map. All right. How come they're all still baseline? They're not. Waster. Baseline is just most common. So it just happens. Dude, this is a waster. That's not baseline. All right. Here we go. And mark these names off. Uh, let's begin the craziness. Okay. <sighs> all right. Go ahead and... Uh, your steadfast allow all the things grab that gun you're incapable of violence yes i know she's pregnant thank you for the, the warning where are those where are those you all right repair on die, master. uh pretty standard boral forest map we got we got some rich soil right near us we might just start right around that area there's a uh, geothermal up there. Uh, yeah, I think we'll just uh, try by just throwing rice down and get that started. All right, we got uh, rice. Oh, we're tunnelers. We're tunnelers too. So just some starter rice. They're gonna be unhappy about it, but then we'll get we'll get changed over. We can also use this to trade. Um, but yeah, let's go and get that. I don't, I don't know how close we are to other factions. I think we were pretty close though. Okay. So Tunnler, Tunnler. Um, where do we want on this map? This area is a pretty good size. Geothermal right there. Another geothermal there. I think we'll just set up here. So let's set up on this side. All right. Um, Yeah, we'll go we'll go a bit more vertical there's the anima tree we might get some uh some tribals this time too it's in a not the greatest position but it's all right it's all right okay all right on work firefighting patienting we have no doctors really uh zeon do you remember the subscription Finger guns, thank you for the gift subs. Thank you, finger guns. Minoc, thank you for the gift sub as well. Word, thank you for the eight months. Thank you guys, much appreciated. 
Am I gonna try to get under a mountain? No. Tumblers are good even outside a mountain. You don't need a you don't need a mountain. Tumblers are just uh they're one of my preferred min-max factions, actually. They're just really good. Uh we'll switch this over to stone relatively soon, so I'm gonna start it out kind of smallish. Small. Destroy that. Get a few doors. It's gonna be a really small starter barracks, but it's alright. It's alright. The chaos, yeah. The chaos playstyle. Okay. Uh child care. We're gonna need that soon. Basic as a one. Wardening. Handling, let's wait on that. No good cooks, but Construction growing. Of course, that person is good at both, so we'll get them on that. Uh, let's have them do construction. They can get better at it. It's fine. No crafters either, really. Fortunate. Unfortunate. And we got Randy, so we can get attacked any moment. There's no, uh, there's no like warm up period for him. So let's go ahead and throw some stockpile in there. So this little one gets started. We'll get over to stone pretty quickly, I think. Pretty quickly. Chance of seeing you play J Line 3. Maybe. Maybe the developers did reach out to me, so maybe. I'll uh I'm not gonna I won't have time to really look at it and decide until next week, but there is a possibility. Alright, gotta get that planted. Let me go ahead and uh that's and let's get a, a, a table up and then a bed. I don't know why I just kept re rotating that over and over. Because we are crash landed, so we do have the ability to make beds already, which is kind of nice. Um, so, yeah, let's do that. I can't believe she's already freaking pregnant, though. Ideology run the other day. Oh, the first ideology run? Yeah, thank you for watching that. Randy, have a warm up so you have a room set up? No. No, we just got really lucky at the beginning of that run. Just got lucky. Uh, let's also put plant cutting as a four on these and growing as a four. And I want to get mushrooms planted pretty quickly. So we'll get a mushroom room over here. But yeah, let, let's just get the base room done. Everything moved in. Got to get a crib and stuff set up. And, um... Yeah, then I guess we'll work on getting mushrooms set up. Fresh one baby in a growth vat if you had the option. Yes. But we don't. Is there two me when a vampire starting stereo or they just regenerate all scars away for 15 days? Kind of unhappy. Just have to keep doing the ritual. <laughs> I'm removing that because I don't want to clean quite as much in there. Better to either have all floored or none floored, so we're going with no floor. Another poor bed, that's unfortunate. So who is the main construction person here? Ligno, go ahead and make the other bed. Come on, why are you botching stuff? Is it because you're 81 years old? It's probably because you're 81 years old. That's what I would guess. You know, I will go ahead and put these Help out a little bit. Uh, let's take a look at our map. So we got an ancient danger nearby, and uh, we'll check some stuff out while they're asleep. We have uh, we have two steam, three steam geysers relatively close. Amatrees in an okay position. We can force things across water down here if we really want to. Uh, aside from breakers, seems okay. Was there any other rich soil anywhere? Not really. Aside from closer to the edge of the map, we might take advantage of that. But we're going to be mainly living off mushrooms anyway. They don't have a lot of fertility sensitivity. So, uh, let's check out the world. We are close to a trader, and these guys can be trade partners as well. So, we got we got some decent trade nearby. Go on, road runner. Welcome in. Oh, you're sounding like a real child? Oh, uh, no. No, I would not. No. Yeah, he also has cataracts, yeah. Yeah, they're, uh, they're not a great pawn. <laughs> Uh, 
these are both ones that you can't ally with anyway, so... We do have a ritual that gives us rep when you're by, so that's nice. These are nearby are actually tradable. Uh, let's see. Uh, you know what? I'm not going to anger those people. Not going to anger them. Not this time, as it turns out. Okay, so we got that planted. Uh, I want to get to... Let's do a, um... Let's get straight to stone. Screw it. Straight to stone. So, stone cutter. And we're going to set crafting as a 4 on everyone because it's global work speed. It's not actually... Uh, it doesn't matter what crafting skill they have. Bring those in, please. All right. So, got a little stuff made. Set up some uh, mushrooms after we get our stone done. Yeah, our people hate human leather or hum humane meat and leather. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Make sure that doesn't go bad either. All right. Um, mainly slate nearby. Now nah, we got some marble. We'll, we'll just start with marble script. Uh, make marble block. Do forever. Drop on the floor. P music is so good, yeah. So good that P music. It's going feral. Nob, welcome in. Someday, welcome in. All right, we're gonna do a uh, stockpile here. And this one, we're gonna put steel, flash steel, uh, uranium, and stone blocks. We just went into raw resources, but it's all right. Never knew how good drop on the floor was. They so tried it. It saved so much time. Yeah, really nice. So, oh, Nikki, welcome in. All right. Ah, uh, they should get to cutting some stones. We'll we'll make a third one actually. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. All the all the P music tracks are on YouTube, and they're also on Spotify. On a sword versus Zeus hammer. The answer is it depends. They're pretty close, so. You know, I like doing a mix of the two because you never know which kind of enemy you're going to face. So I just do a mix of the two. Welcome. You know, whether you want blunt damage and the uh, uh, mech stun, shield pop, etc. Or you want just literal cutting power. Welcome back. Uh, Metallic, thank you for the 24 months. Greatly appreciated. Me too. Thank you, Metallic. Glad you're still around. And KO, eight, 18 months. Thank you, KO. Also very much appreciated. Roll soundtrack to get more music. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. No, I, yeah. <laughs> Why no seats at workstations? Uh, seats at workstations. What? I didn't do this. The friggin' Lynx killed their child. Anyway, uh, no seats at workstations. Generally, so it. All right, so seats at workstations. All it does is increase comfort. It doesn't increase work production or anything like that just increases comfort so generally they're not going to be there long with biphasic they're already capping comfort twice a day and they're not going to be there super long amount of time anyway um they're going and picking up the scatter drop stuff that's fine so for me i usually don't do it just because they're already getting comfort max twice a day elsewhere and uh you know it's more wealth more raiders early it's typically why i don't all right, let's go ahead and set up some zones while they're getting that stuff brought in. So, but yeah, if, if you're doing it thinking it helps them at their workstation, it doesn't. It just increases comfort. That's it. Why are they seats the table? Because they want to eat at a table without. They literally want to eat at the table without seats. Inside. Walls. Work. And animals. You know, for now. All right. The work zone. Uh, we'll let you guys go at a decent amount right now. You guys still going after the scatter stuff? 
Yeah. All right, bring back whatever you're getting. Yeah, the scattered steel. And then uh, after that, you guys stay in the work zone. Going, Zach, welcome in. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Amazing, mission complete. All right there, that's why you're the best boss. The one and only. <laughs> How big is the mountain nearest? Uh, there's, this is a flat map, so these are just very small hills, so not very big. All right, we're starting to get our blocks, so we're gonna go ahead and get moved over to some marble. Um, I think I'm gonna build more long instead of like square. It's very similar anyway, but just, Welcome just back. for a little bit of difference. Loyalty greatly appreciated all right so up six there we go start on that side oh, just a little bit of variety currently disabled dev mode uh quinto thank you for the five months thank you quinto entire map except your mushrooms will all the pollution go into your mushrooms if like any new pollution yeah it just spreads in yeah, it'll keep spreading but you can put it as a zone to clear pollution if you if you want you can put a clear pollution pollution zone around where your mushrooms are oh man second trimester i can't believe she came pregnant really what an inconvenience for me why wasn't she thinking about me when she was getting pregnant? Wait, that doesn't sound quite right. Hmm. The memes. Um, I need to update the list, but we got pretty lucky on the memes, but we got not so lucky on the precepts. So are people like light weapons? We didn't get shooting specialists. We got crackheads. We have to have slaves in this one. We're basically tunneler slavers. Pretty much. Pretty much. Um, yeah, it's fine. Welcome back. Your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated. All right. Uh, Tiberius, this it was six months. Don't put yourself down like that. Thank you, Ty. Much appreciated. Maybe she won. What an inconvenience this pregnant woman is to me. What a jerk. What a jerk. Can't believe she's done, she's done this. Uh, we gotta we gotta really get going here with uh power and stuff too don't think we're gonna have the geothermal in the first winter but we can uh can put mushrooms around it for the winter that'd be fine we can do that do that constant limiting your well to reduce rate size kind of artificial for you should you try wealth infinite you can you can put wealth infinite it's a fun way to play yeah or we can try playing on the hard difficulties without worrying about wealth too Kind of like what I do during the community challenge days. Those can both be fun ways to uh, play as well. So we'll get our initial base set up here. A little base. Just a small base. Smallish. Uh, that base is average size. How's it going, Tweety Wilkman? In half, Cycler, Tree Slave, Marlin Trees, maybe. Steadfast loyalty is Ibex, 65 months since the dawn of time. Thank you, Ibex. Long time. I have a guide on pawn traits. Yes, I have a very long guide that goes over every single trait in the game. Exclamation traits will get you there. Goes over every trait in the game, tells you how it works, and uh, which ones I find best. Worse. And Raccoon. 
All right, where is that? Well, at least the raccoon doesn't explode on death. You know, we got that going for us this time. Explode on death? What are you talking about? Uh, go watch this community challenge that I did this last Sunday. <laughs> oh, man, that was brutal. Brutal. I'm going to do a second run of that. Soul guy, nonviolent. Yeah. Yeah. A waster that's incapable of violence. What a waste indeed. What a waste indeed. Come on, hit it. I would be so sad if Maligno died. What a tragic... What a, what a tragedy, rather. What a tragic... Uh oh, we gotta hit. Hey, look. Maligno's delicious. Go after him. Stop going after him. Stop going after... Oh, God. <laughs> We don't have a doctor, so every little uh, thing that this raccoon does to us could be pretty deadly. There we go. We're good. We're good. He will join us or die. Master. No worries. Never, never worried. Uh, let's put corpses there. Just all corpses for right now. It's fine. We're about food production in a little bit. I get this other stuff set up. Uh, Julia, thank you for the gift sub also. Thank you, Julia. Much appreciated to uh, Feral Rage. Thank you. He won't fight, so I'll make him the bait. That's that's absolutely yes. That's absolutely yes. See, I can speak today. Partially. I can partially speak today. All right. Um, and expand the work just a little bit. We have to get other kinds of stone, that's fine. But I think there should be plenty around. Be plenty. How do you determine how much rice to grow? Uh, you're gonna love this. The answer is it depends, but dep depending on which kind of soil you're putting it in, usually 20 to 25 plots of rice per colonist. That on simple meals forever. Overgrowing can be good because you can just trade the extra. But um, for us, we want to switch over to mushrooms pretty quickly. And mushrooms shouldn't be too hard to grow during the winter, so. Wild man wanders in. Are you amazing? No, but I'm beautiful. I'll be the judge of that. My judgment is in. Jess. Jess, my judgment is in, and I think you're a liar. Plants and cooking. Growing more and making fine lavish meals worth the effort? Usually not, because you can usually just get better mood easier ways beautiful yeah right all right this is rng run one slaves are required that's right yeah we will have slaves because they are required yep yep but a lot of those precepts don't come active until higher um higher expectations so Higher expectations. All right, almost done with that initial setup. All right. That one closed off. Nice. We'll get a little prison started. Now that we got that done, we will go ahead and deconstruct this. One of the easiest ways to get more impressiveness in a room is just to make the room bigger. So that's one thing we're working on. Cave-based ideology win. It just didn't roll it. This is RNG run. I didn't pick this. Uh, I have lots of... I have lots of tunneler mountain runs on YouTube. So there's the dwarf run. There's the... Arco Nexus run. Uh, the fluid ideology run. There's quite a few of them. Probably a couple more I'm forgetting to. Winston Waves. The waves. Uh, I think Cool Ranch. Thank you for watching. Thank you for coming over. Yeah, you can use fine meals and lavish meals like drugs, but as far as just like their their normal meals, I generally don't do that. But you can use them as like drugs. You can have like a stack of them disallowed, and if you're having a pawn that's really upset, you can just go force them to eat them, yeah. You can definitely do that. 
right. Uh, so we will get our little prison done, and then we'll get a mushroom area set up. I think I might do the initial mushroom area over that. So I first attempt the RNG. Yeah, we just literally just started. Yep. Just started. First run. All right. So let's uh, let's think about go ahead and for the winter, we'll probably just put mushrooms up here. Probably. Let's do like a tall base. I don't know. I don't know why. I don't think I've ever done that. <laughs> That's a, it's not very efficient. But uh. That's fine. There's efficiency. For funsies. Long house, tall house, all of the things. All right. Um, that's fine. Should keep that above temperature at least. Oh no. She had the baby. We don't have a doctor. This could be bad. She could die right off the bat. Ugh. The baby could die. If the baby comes out sick, there's nothing we can do about it. Nothing we can do about it. Go and make a crib. Ligno. Alright. I need to make a different bed too. Slightly better bed. Alright, so that'll do, that'll do. Get rid of that one. Can't believe she came pregnant. <sighs> Third man's the doctor. Three. <laughs> A three. Okay, well. What's she gonna do? What's she gonna do? Preemptively dig some graves. Jesus. Easy fourth spawn. <laughs> yeah. To make smoothie and thought orange and it turns out grapefruit was threw up just taking a fruit vegetable for something else i don't think so no <laughs> I, I can remember offhand interesting question but no i don't think so let's try let's try what are the names of the factions we got northern coda not northern korea <laughs> uh moink i'm gonna go with it ve that's not how it's pronounced at all whoa thubba I think that's maybe a Tub thumping. Anyway, on Vinch. Eat, she beat. Eat, she beat. And poison toxers. Blue Imperium. Some of these things are not like the others. Some of these things just don't belong. Uh, yeah, I haven't decided on quest rewards yet, but I will do the or the, the medical. So for anyone that doesn't know, you can come in. This is not a mod. Go to health go to defaults you can turn these to what you want that way when like someone shows up like a uh you know a prisoner and they have a minor cut you don't waste your medicine on them if you don't want so we'll go ahead and do that we'll go ahead and do that I haven't decided on um you know what let's go ahead I haven't decided on goodwill or not yet I might leave goodwill on for now actually I have an artist so maybe I won't get rid of the rest of that floor Wait, wait on that. All right, so we're gonna set some more wood to be chopped here. And we're gonna get a few traps down, so hopefully we can snag some prisoners so that we die to starvation during the winter. So that's what everyone wants, is for their colony to die of starvation during the winter. That's what I always say. That's what my granny always used to say. Always blame it on your granny. So we're doing the 
trap tunnel like this so that um, the enemies try to avoid fences because it slows them down every other notch. Our, our colonists can go through diagonally and rebuild the traps without triggering them themselves. So we're going to have a little bit of a little trap tunnel to help us. One of those stories Titan loves so much. And yeah, we're about to have a story of this. Oh my God, this, this wild person. Freaking wild person. Our people hate corpses and they hate a gift. A gift from Northern Korea. It's a sash. For dive dysentery. Um, our people hate corpses. And you may meet. They're actually pretty strong too. If he does any damage, we might be in trouble. But uh, he's going to eat our food. All right, screw it. We got to take care of this. Cal, are you... Uh, I was going to say, are you our best pawn? Unfortunately, maybe. It might, they might actually be, unfortunately. It might be our best pawn. All right, here we go. I see it. Why are you so fast? Oh, no. I have a doctor. Well, this might become naked brutality real quick. <laughs> Maybe mine's the naked part. Oh, she's pregnant. She's pregnant. Adam, why'd you have the pregnant woman kite them? No reason. No reason. Oh, God. Okay. It's fine. The pregnant woman only got beat up a little bit. You know, that's not a big deal. Oh, Goals to the run, just survive. Yeah, just survive. Praise the sun. Uh, Swag Lord. <laughs> Better be. Uh, Swag Lord, maybe using the Twitch Prime here. Gonna have that baby soon. Uh, we're getting some medical skill before the birth. Yeah, that's it. That's it. It's all part of the plan. We didn't plan for that at all. It's all part of the plan. Yeah, the nudists we should actually probably go ahead and put on. Yeah, I should do it. Just help with their mood. It's not cold yet, so. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Um. Okay. There you go. We'll put that stuff on the pregnant lady. Hey, can you bring that pregnant woman's gun inside? Thank you. Thanks. There you go. Well, she's very pregnant. What do you mean by that? She's moving slowly. That's all I mean by it. Let's go on dueling kitty. Thank you. Thank you. That's all I mean by it. Uh, just healthy or sickly. Yeah. Yeah. Unless they're inbred or something. She's eating for two. Uh, so you're not eating for two. We're going to get meals set up, but ugh, we don't have a cook, really, so it's going to be bad. Uh, we're going to go ahead and set this cook some meal. Do you have X? We're going to put X pretty low, like one day's worth. Like one day's worth at the moment. Uh, and we are going to turn on a meat and animal product minus the humane meat. This is so that they use the stuff that's going to go bad first. And then we'll turn vegetables on on this one. Expand this only. Oh boy. Uh, our people like insect meat because they're tunnelers. Issues, but when you do get it. Uh, yeah, biotech is really good. It's like multiple DLCs in one, honestly. They could have divided biotech up into two DLCs, and I don't think people would have complained about it. If they didn't know, you know. Yeah, biotech has a lot of uh, a lot of good stuff. 
lot of added value for sure. By far the largest. You'll see. Yeah, yeah, I'm waiting. Um, I'm going, whoops. I'm gonna go ahead and do the Neutrongus around the, the geysers. So I'm kind of waiting on some more stone. Show the pond. We got a kind nudist, 14 years old. We got kind torture artist, 25 years old. And she came pregnant. Then we have a waster that's incapable of violence who's 81 years old. Can't seem to find it in the workshop. Camera Plus, it's there, yeah. Type in Camera Plus. Buy so many meals to start because we have really bad cooks. And if they make a poison meal and put it on top of the stack, it poisons all of them. So if we get food poisoning, we know we're only going to have that day worth of food poisoning. Ground slavers. Fun looking group. Yeah, yeah fun. So yeah, we're going to make very few meals because we're going to get a lot of food poisoning meals. Uh, if you have trouble finding it, you can look at the, yeah, the Room World Community Challenge mod list. Yeah. Uh, yeah, as long as they're safe links. Yeah, you've been here long enough. It'll let you it'll let you do it. Okay, so we need to allow them to go where there's... Oh, wait. They're already, they're already able to. It's just they have other work to do. Other work to do. Um, You know what, Maligno? Hide in room. Oh boy. What a great start. You got gifted a sub even when you're not in stream. It happens all the time on Twitch. Yeah. Sometimes people will get a random gift sub that haven't even been here in like a year. Real life, but it looks cool. Five random pawns, and you make those pawns very carefully. I don't know, maybe, maybe. I have used ChatGPT for other things, but not for that. Not, for that. not yet. All right, we got uh, a little prison. Uh, we can make the barracks a little bit better. Kind of. We'll do it. Might as well. So we're gonna put daylilies. Daylilies can grow just straight in the in the dirt with torch light. They only require fifty light, so five hundred percent speed. No, it's five hundred percent difficulty. Five hundred percent isn't a speed modifier. It's a it's a raid scaling modifier. Threat scale five hundred percent. Break on Maligno. Yeah, he'll be fine. Sure sense, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Playing at five hundred percent speed the entire run, everything would die quickly. Was baby's dad in space? Yeah, I guess so. Somewhere, somewhere. What's the baby liberator? You know what? No, I'm not gonna do that. Okay, so let's go ahead and set this. We're gonna go into quests. We're gonna go to reward preference again. This is not a mod. We're gonna turn off goodwill. That way, our only options for quest rewards are monetary. Welcome back. Ah, hang on. Loyalty is greatly appreciated. Uh, no, I'm not going to. A mod, 500 speed mod. Felgen, they really eight months to eat Felgen. Yeah, I'm sure the baby's dad will show up in a raid and we'll end up killing him or some bullcrap, and then she's going to be upset for like half a year. Uh, who's on cooking? Oh god, the pregnant woman. The pregnant lady is on cooking. Alright. Go ahead and get uh prison ready. A very tall base. Don't usually do that. Alright. Mission and quest reward preferences, those are useful. Yeah, yeah. Uh, a lot of people think those are mods. Uh, one of the most common questions I get in YouTube comments about things like that, too, as I get asked, what mod changes these into categories? It's not a mod. Uh, I highly suggest you look at all these buttons in the bottom right. There's some really good, important stuff down there, including categorize mode. So uh, that's just a button in the bottom right, not a mod. But I get asked it a whole lot. So we got Spermacist, Proselytizer, Tunneler, but we also randomize all precepts. So we don't have Shooting Specialist. We like light weapons. We don't like heavy weapons. That's probably the biggest one is the weapon one. We also are required slaves. There's a... Yeah. We're basically Tunneler slavers that don't like corpses or organs and only like light weapons. 
unfortunately, on the light weapons, but... We like tasty insect meat and mushrooms. Uh, we are still using um, rice for now, but uh, I think I will just get this set up. That might actually be enough mushrooms to last us the entire season. So we can get something better. Fine. Yeah. Charge rifle is a light weapon, yeah. That game is fine. I don't like charge rifles. We probably still won't use charge rifles. Devil summon. I should disable those the beginning of runs because I can't really super pay attention to the run and uh, that since it doesn't give me an alert and I have to scroll up and find it. There it is. I'm glad you found a home for your double D's. Is it hell? Is it hell, Satan? Hell, Satan. Well, demonetize. Don't put that in the edit. What's wrong with charge rifles? They're just worse for my playstyle in every way than assault rifles. Charge rifles don't have enough range. Can't kite anything with them. I don't outrange centipedes. They're expensive. Yeah, it's too bad. Charge lances really suck. It's too bad. Too bad. I'll go over uh, the weapon stuff more as we get into weapons, but yeah. I can't even remember the last time I used charge rifles because assault rifles for my play style are just better in pretty much every way. A wager on the birth result? No, probably not. Uh, let's keep her near the... You're inside right now. What do I consider a successful run? Seeing the credits. That's it for me. And themselves by day 100. Make it day 100 and then you consider it a win. I always try to get to the credits. SMGs ever change shotguns? No. I hardly ever use SMGs anymore either. Change shotguns are extremely good. Something about zombies? Yeah, that's going to be the split game for today. Not anything to do with RimWorlds. Split game. So RimWorlds split streams. Half the day, RimWorlds half the day. Is... I mean, SMGs are still fine. You can still use them, especially early game and on bad shooters early. But um, yeah, I don't build for them. Yeah, the shotgun tunnel is, is very effective and much much cheaper, earlier, easy to build. Better. Charge rifle was in the 20 year run. Yeah, I haven't used charge rifles in forever. Because the range on them just isn't good enough. Pawns defend from one raid at 100 pawns. Consider it a win. I only consider it a win if the game tells me I won. So the credits. For me, for me, Welcome again. Back. Snowfall. Your steadfast loyalty. In months, is double digits. Thank you, Snowfall. So much appreciated. Um, you know what? I don't care what this one's made from. That's. I mean, they're almost almost done doing that now. Might as well just let them do it. Just let them do it. Yeah, yeah, we'll get... Uh, we also need to get a priest pretty soon, but I don't really have anyone that I would want as a priest. Uh, Torture Art is a priest. I don't know, man. Yeah, no one's a good priest. So. so I'm a game you played is out now? Yeah, it's literally what I'm playing today on, on the second half of the stream, yep. Yeah, the developer sent me a key for it. So that's what I'll be playing today for the second half. Yep, yep. your life what the royal victory has credits are you talking about arco nexus the arco nexus doesn't uh or the arco nexus well the arco nexus has credits also hang on i'm not sure what you mean <laughs> it doesn't have the awesome song and it reloads to where your colonists are standing around the arco nexus but Oh, oh, you mean you failed it. I got you. I got you. 
I thought you mean you actually did the ending and then it didn't happen. I was like, hang on a second. Three guys spent the colonists in the Royal Ascent ship. Yeah. <laughs> I know what it should be. Yeah, I, I got you. I, I misread. I thought you were saying you did it. And magnanimous dispensation. Cool grandpa. Coolest grandpa ever. Giving me a hundred dollars. I need some more cool grandpas in my life. Uh, cool grandpa. That's very generous of you. Thank you for that. I want to thank you for the many hours of entertainment. Can't often catch you live. Appreciate you uploading full streams YouTube. It's a great work. Wish you continued success. Uh, thank you, cool grandpa. That is very kind of you. Kind words and kind donation. Uh, that is super generous. Such a cool grandpa. Thank you. I don't have any grandpas left aside from that one. Who needs other ones? I do appreciate it. All right, it's going to get toasty in there. Toasty. We'll see. We'll see how it's toasty. The biggest thing is that we have, we're required to be slavers. We're tunnelers on a flat map and we like light weapons. Slaver tunnelers with light weapons. So not too bad. Yeah, we'll have to do, uh, if this one succeeds, we'll have to do another one with some uh, other random things like a season two. Is 10,000 rate points the max at 500%? Yes, you just get there way faster. Let's get there way faster. We're going to see what the max out temperature in there is. We might make it a little bit bigger. Oh, uh, she's in labor. She's in labor. All righty. Here we go. That doesn't help, but whatever. Here we go. Can you kill one of the starting pawns? Maybe. We're about to find out. Best doctor is three cataract. Yeah. The doctor's naked. <sighs> Grandpa I called looking to chat. Call him back. Grandpa I've been dead for a decade and never figured out who called. It's probably a scam. Probably a scam. All right, Talgarth. Survive, please. Survive. But can you hurry it along? We got mushroom fields to build, you know, plants. Healthy baby, and she survived. Wow. That's kind of surprising. <laughs> that is that is pretty surprising, to be honest with you. Pretty surprising. Alright, cool. Never worried. You always turn on healthy babies, custom settings. Sick babies are too stressful. I can understand that one. No, I left all that as default aside from the 500%. All right, so how hot did that end up getting? Um, We can grow in there. They're going to get sweaty in there. But we can always uh, unroof a tiny part of it during uh, this time of year. All right. Let's get that Nutrifungus going. Yeah. Excellent. Vince, Raiders will attack Vince. So we'd have to surround the vent as well. Blue on our puppy. Uh oh. I'm sure our award winning doctors will take care of this no problem. I'm sure of it, actually. Uh, and they're also bonded to the pregnant lady. Excellent. Vince, let in light, no. Alright, um... So we can use the... Bryce to, uh... Trade if we need to. Alright, mushrooms getting planted. Excellent, excellent. A second door there in case that one gets held open. Eat stroke, yeah, yeah. I do need to unroof more of it during this time of year. Unroof some more of it. 
or make it larger. Ah, we'll fix all that in a little bit. For now, we're just trying to get some uh, some basics down so we, we have some food coming in during the winter. Maybe a slave when it grows up? No, I'm not. As long as it's better than rice, they're tunnelers, so... But for us, it is, because we get a debuff for eating rice, so... Uh, eating rice is actually hurting their mood, whereas mushrooms will increase it. Does so smoke pop, Psycast, just make your pods eat way more beans and say... Psychic power when they rip one? No. <laughs> No, luckily. Tahit, in our growing zone. How did you do that without overheating the room? You just got to make the room big enough, and then you can, uh, during the summer, you can just unroof it or unroof part of it. So We just have it partially unroofed. Event. Our modest fellowship expands. Or you can just make the room bigger. <laughs> That's true. Those are all... Possible. Uh, Mustafa. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. Thank you for using that here, Mustafa. Much appreciated. Safe drug policy for high life kids. So take whatever the drug is and then double it for their age. So, uh, for instance, if you have a kid that's addicted to flake, what are you doing while your children are addicted to flake? Um, you can go in here and go to safe dull. Uh, well, not flake is never safe. So, but anyway, go to a safe dose interval. And over here, whatever the number is for their age, double it. And then put them on that. Twice as much for the babies. No, not not twice as much amount. I don't know. Twice as much time. And it should be should be safe. Doggo is beating the flu. Nice. Oh my god. Randy's coming for our mushrooms already. Christ sake, Randy. Christ sake. And a manhunter? What is it? Well, the mushroom's gone. <laughs> uh, let's just use the traps on these manhunters. Maybe we can save some of them. Come on. Get here already. Two more, let's go. You will join us or die, Master. There we go. We're saving the shrooms. Balin, thank you for the 100 bits. Chat, did you know the first bit donation you make every 30 days to an additional channel points? First gift sub every 30 days gives you a... I haven't heard that in a while, Balin. You haven't done that in a few months. Balin, thank you for the gift sub to Red Wizard. Thank you, Balin. Thank you, matey. Yeah, yeah. Why don't I use the auto home zone? Because I don't want them cleaning random crap out in the middle of nowhere. There's things I don't want them to clean. So if I put random homes or uh, the home zone, this out here is going to be home zone. They're going to clean this. I don't care if they clean this. If I have to put a zone over here for mining or like move a drill or put down an animal bed somewhere to save something or whatever. It's going to make a big spot of home zone that I just have to clear. So I don't I don't want them to clean, to spend time cleaning some of the outdoors and areas that don't matter. So I, I, I choose where they do it. He will join us or die. Cleaning zone is one of the nicest quality of life mods. Yeah, that's a good one. Mitchie. Thank you for the gift sub also. Thank you, Mitchie. To similar XD. Cleaning dirt isn't fun or useful. Yeah, it just takes up time. You know what? We're going to have to put corners on here so that um, fire doesn't spread in. I'll just do this. For now, it's fine. All right, we got to get a few more traps back down. Hopefully, Randy sends a normal raid so we can get a prisoner. We need some we need some good pawns. Trash really matter for moving when they're traveling for Lark Zone. Home. Yeah, not really. Like, they're going to have a unsightly environment as they walk through, right? But it's not a big deal. 
Home zone really needs to be firefight and rebuild while snow zone needs to be cleaning as well. Yeah, that'd be nice. Cleaning in snow. <laughs> I have a good pond in a few years and this thing grows up. Yeah. <laughs> we last that long. We got pretty lucky on the meme rolls, honestly. There's some precepts that aren't super great that we got, but in general, we got we got relatively lucky. All right, so we'll probably be good through the winter. We could even expand on that a little bit. So our goal now will be uh, we're not gonna we're not gonna plant any more of this rice. We'll get um, I think we'll get research going, and we'll try to actually get to geothermal and, and guns. Uh, everyone can research at least, so we got that going for us. So let's go ahead and get our research benches up here. Welcome back. Your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated. Here we go. We'll start with those three. And yeah, I'm just going to beeline to geothermal, I think. Uh, we have normal research speed. Imagine if it ro rolled slow. <laughs> Roxy, 20 months. Someone want to support the content. Thank you. Thank you, Roxy. Yeah, I, di I didn't know you were still around. So I very much appreciate it. Thank you for continuing that. It's the most colonists I ever had. I think high 70s. High 70s a couple times. Um. So the growing period, we have about... 12 more days, something like that. 12 more days. All right, let's go ahead and suspend these for now. And we need a little bit more wood. Okay. How do you keep track of that many? You don't really need to. Like, once you get a lot of colonists, it's all about macro management rather than micromanagement. You get a pawn. You see what they're good at. You just specialize their schedule and their work for that. If you're using a barracks, check if you have an unknown bed. If not, throw one more bed down. That's it. Done. Don't have to worry about it. Uh, Black, they really give something to TDH. TDH for their 17th one. I was about to say, TDH has been here a long time. Thank you, Black. Full sec. Welcome in. I've done, yeah, it hasn't been that long since we did a, a tropical swamp. But this was random. Like, I didn't I didn't choose this. The whole point of this run is to just hit random map and go with it. Random map and go with it. Uh, all right. So the puppy, uh, not quite ready to haul yet. We'll just leave them inside to the ready to haul. Stop using end tables. Does it not matter once you get a certain quality bed? So if I'm using barracks, I always use an end table between the fours because it's easy. To do but basically if you have an excellent or better bed it only takes one attached item to max out do i like using barracks it's hard not to use barracks because they're so powerful in fact during the harry run we were talking about what they could do to nerf barracks because they're so much they're so strong they're just they're just they're maybe too good is the thing but i don't think a lot of people use them because they don't realize how good they are but yeah barracks are so incredibly strong that it's hard not to uh hard not to use them Another door there. We're going to build a roof over there to slow some enemies down as they come in. Uh, but yeah, it only takes one of the one connection to a bed if it's excellent or better to kind of cap out the benefit. So you can use just a dresser if you want or just an end table per four beds, whichever one. But yeah, excellent or better is where the break point is. I can use them so you won't waste time making separate rooms. Yeah, and they're just, they're so much more efficient. They're more work efficient, more movement efficient, uh, very smaller footprint, which goes to those. They're very wealth efficient, so less raid points, less raiders. Uh, you don't have to build like an extra room like you're talking about. They combine as three different room types. You can make, so people are getting like the, just getting the very spacious environment while they're in the barracks offsets the difference between um, a bedroom and a barracks and the disturbed sleep caps out at minus three so it's like nothing it's they're so strong I have a mod list I play with almost no mods but there's the list yeah exclusion mods 
Does the barracks need to be a certain quality or uh, the dresser? No, no, excellent or higher. And then just attach a dresser or an end table and you're good to go. Yeah, it's very hard to go back, to try to go back to um, bedrooms after playing with the barracks because they're just, they're so friggin' strong. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and go in here. I'm gonna make a zone. Do new zone, area one. We're gonna put it over this. Schedule, we're gonna put Maligno in that zone. And we are gonna change his schedule to all work. And now Maligno is gonna cut all this. And then as soon as he gets done. Put him back on just default schedule is fine. And now we will delete that zone. Yeah. Replace settings when a wall breaks. Uh, yeah, it's, it's the little, um, little automatic rebuild button down here, the little hammer button. Which weapons do you use in game? Almost always assault rifles. I just did a 5% no pause, parry, persistent, all assault rifles. They're just the easiest one to win with no kill box. They make no kill box pretty easy, actually. Ah, uh, Vita, thank you for the 11 months. Thank you, Vita. It's almost a full calendar year. Assault rifles are just king at high powered kiting. The structure has to be in your home zone to auto repair, yeah. That's also true. <laughs> and a couple more traps. Two nose. Randy's gonna hit. Mushrooms will be coming in soon. Welcome back. Um, Your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated. Get more mushrooms over here too eventually so we'll have that side of the base just be mushrooms yeah i should actually like eat a huge colony for a really long time <clears throat> will i use kill boxes around i haven't decided yeah i was gonna make it be determined on what weapons it gave us it gave us light weapons which allows us to use assault rifles so maybe not i'm not sure yet I give all pawns, yeah, assault rifle, don't care. Keep on SMG, SMG is too short range, nope. Nope, I skip SMGs entirely, no kill box runs. Ah, uh, Kane, they were the five months you came. So, um, what I was talking about with barracks, like, I don't think most people use barracks so they don't realize how strong they are, and I still have people come in that argue that bedrooms are better. Play with whatever you want, but barracks are way more efficient in pretty much every way. However, if they were going to nerf barracks, there's a few ways they could do it. One, they can make it just so barracks cannot double as any other room type. That alone would make it so you at least had to have two or three big big rooms instead of one big room for everything. That's the first one. The other one would be they can make it scale the expectations. So the higher expectations, the more of a mood hit a barracks gives you. Uh, those are the two most likely, I think, that they would do. But they've already buffed barracks. They've always been strong, and they already buffed them. Used to, a long time ago, they made it so Disturb Sleep stacked. So it didn't stop at three. But uh, they changed that stack. It's only to three. Uh, smoke machine. No. Drop fertilized eggs. Animals that hatch belong to the faction that dropped them. I thought they fixed that. They still have fixed that. I swore that was in a patch note, but maybe that was something else they fixed. Make it so any kind of, yeah, like slower rest recovery or something. Oh, concrete floors, probably, yeah. Probably. I know I probably shouldn't, but we'll see. For some reason. That was a Randy random uh, run. Let's go on. Eversore, welcome in. Ali, you're starving. You're just literally cook food. Let's see, immediately food poisoning. Stars, okay. 
Got lots of steel nearby. That's good. That is good. It's going to be winter time pretty soon, too. Yeah, like the fancy tiles take a really long time. Like the fancy stone tiles. All right. Yep. Yeah, throw up mid meal. Delicious. Delicious. We might actually get geothermal for the uh, old, old hits. We'll see. I really thought we were going to get something crazier on the last time we got some really crazy for memes on the RNG runs that we were doing, but not this time. Tunneler slavers that like light weapons, pretty much. Relatively standard. You cast geothermal, does it still heat the room enough? Yeah, yeah, it still heats um, even with the actual generator on it. We'll just have to probably make the room a little bit bigger. Going germ, welcome in. Complete the ship from the Star's Quest. You always do. I have done that one, yeah. Just a couple times though, not nowhere near as much. I like building my own, but it's been a long time since I did one of those. Maybe we should do one of those too, where we travel to the ship, just for a change of pace. Watched a few of your videos. Haven't gone back so much so that if you're in Royal Pines, wait until you get an aesthetic one. Yeah, yeah. Generator does not produce lights, as far as I remember. Gunguero? Don't think so. Either way, with the with the generator, the power of that, we can heat uh, a mushroom grow area. Can't build your own store bought ship is fine. <laughs> the truth digger of Earth. Can't believe one of our random one of our uh, ideology or random roles in here for our ideology is, is a crackhead. Crackhead slavers. Excellent. Crackhead slavers, that was just a random roll. <laughs> so we have a slight problem here. Maligno is gonna run out of flake. Raid! Tag immediately. Maybe we'll actually get prisoners. Itakeen. Hardworking body modder. Fast walker. 54. Go juice addiction. All right, let's get some shooting experience. Always oh, got one. Got one. Not ah, safe temperature. It's safe enough. Oh, I know why. Which one was that one? Uh, oh God, we ripped his. We ripped his arm off. He's a body modder, though. He'll be happy about that. Hard worker. A cook. Might actually take them. If they survive. With our amazing doctoring skills. It's Maligno. I forgot which one. It's so weird that they don't explode on death. <laughs> For anyone that doesn't know, we're doing a community challenge this month. I just played it on this previous Sunday. Where everything explodes on death. So, uh... When I was putting them in there, I was like, oh my god, what if they die, though, and they blow up? <laughs> I don't know, wrong run. Wrong run. Uh, yeah, because one is genes, yeah. One, one is gene-related on that other guy. Ripped his arm off, though. Like, slow down death turned on on every run now. No, pro probably not. So Maligno is going to eventually die if we don't give them uh, uh, drugs. A prisoner being held, blah, blah, blah. Is being held in the camp, blah, blah, blah. Brother of Drifter Bar. I don't know. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and convert this guy. More mouths to feed for the winter. That's what we want. Hey, the baby's happy. Hooray. Why wouldn't you be? Look at... Look at the wealth that you live among. Among? Amongst? What a great environment to raise a child. Everything explodes around when? Last Sunday. I just did it. It's, it's up on uh, YouTube already. Uh, 
make it a little bigger for chaos. I'm gonna do a second run of it because it was so crazy. Yeah, I we need him though. I mean, we could enslave him and have him be an enslave cook. Cooking and doctoring, we need both of those pretty, pretty dire. We're in pretty dire need of those, so. A run, not can you challenge? Oh, like a, oh, you mean like a full run? Maybe. I feel like in the long run, it might be easier. No, no, no. Get out of here. No. Oh God, that's our only good pawn. Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Hit it, Talgarth. Oh my God. There we go. Full slow death run. Oh, here we go again. Oh, our pawns are so bad at combat. Sake. All right, tend to yourself. Time outside will upset a uh, tunneler, not undergrounder. I don't, I don't, I don't think it matters, right? Yeah, if I remember right, it's just that they don't mind small spaces. They're not, it's not the same as undergrounder. You I mean you can have both, but have both. Friend. Uh, you can go to the beginning of the VOD if you want to look through it more, but here's the, the basics to it that we rolled. But beginning of the VOD, if you click back, um, I go through all, all these that it randomized. Uh, Tina Arena, 68 months. The longest one I've seen. 68 months. Actually, what did you just say? The longest one I've seen. I'm sticking to it. Uh, thank you for the 68 months. time uh wait they do they they do hate outdoors too what it's uh i don't know how much time sorry i don't know it's that it, it doesn't conflict with underground or not the other way around i don't know how long the time is yeah time wrong yeah it just swaps the need yeah pull around mushroom patches near the bottom Maybe, maybe. I don't care if that rots. Mushrooms will be coming in real soon. We'll be eating that instead. That'll make them a little bit happier. Maybe you need to grow up. How are you not 13 years old already? I've only been alive for three seasons. Yeah, well, less than that, actually. We're only 23 days in. <laughs> I've only been alive for like five days. Yeah, well, you seem pretty knowledgeable. Someone that's only five days old. How are you speaking to me right now? Huh? I explain that. All right, down to sixty percent. One's going okay so far. That's a huge time investment. Yeah, but they stick with them. They, you can raise god pawns. Yeah. Welcome back. Your steadfast loyalty. Another raid already. Appreciated. Toxers this time. Prepare for a while. We're up to three. Well, that could be a lower old too, actually. That looks not too crazy. Let's see. Unwavering. Great memory night owl. 52. Don't super need that one. We're gonna be a little bit. Ooh, a genie. I'd probably take the genie. Slow learner genie. Mm, I don't know. 
I don't know if I want any of these, honestly. Uh, that one's like all right, but. Yeah, it's true. Uh, we might get lucky and get some drugs off of them as well. Smoke leaf, beer. Yeah, yeah not, there's, there's some okay ones there. Uncle Jay, 19 already. Thank you, Uncle Jay. Yeah, but I mainly have the genie for crafting. That's what I'm on the lookout. Ever, anyone, I don't care what their intellect is as far as research goes. They, they can still research even with a bad one, but. Or so we can just die, genies. Yeah, they, they do take that extra damage. I should get some art early. I'd, it's risky, but I gotta get mood up, so I think I'm just gonna do it. Oh, nice hit. Piles down. That's the genie. Hmm. Ah, oh, man. Slow learner is one of my least favorite traits in the whole game. Uh, let's get... Nah, screw him. Screw him. Early game, you get a lot more. Because of something called population intent, we'll have a lot more uh, options for early pawns. So we'll be a little bit more particular with our early pawns. Let's go in, Psycho. Welcome in. Uh, Granny Summon. Where? There it is. Like my dear old Granny used to say, she was always saying this. Some people are gonna get naked real fast. That's true. Granny knows uh, knows about this precept right here. Free and approved physical love. It's true, I could just make him a slave to make people happy. I have to feed him, you know? I have to feed him. I'll think about it. We can at least get medical experience, right? At least get medical experience. All goods. Uh, we need to go ahead and get the... I think I'm going to make them the priest. Naked priest. Welcome back. Your steadfast loyalty is... We can always change it later. Let's just do it. I gotta get that. Uh, they're gonna have two higher excitations. I, I got to get the mood up across the, the colony, so... Alright, go for it. What? Due to extreme temperature? Is there any... Not that cold in here. Come on. kids yet yeah we one of those starting random pawns was pregnant so she's a little slave for granny and <laughs> okay at least when i preach health i suppose uh maybe maybe I'll be unhappy putting clothes on, but are mainly staying indoors. I need to get a vent here before, but we'll just do another, uh, another fire. Try to keep them happy. Minimize those breakouts. Maybe he's happy at least. That's good. A long time finish that smoke leaf joint there. Dump those guys in the river. Uh, lake, lake. How do you educate kids? Well, they they open up jobs at different ages, so they open up hauling and cleaning first, and then it'll just keep opening on different age break points. As far as teaching them. Uh, I'll go over it more when the kid's older, but basically you want to have a desk connected to three blackboards. 
and then you will go into their needs and it'll show what the next thing is they want to do and just make sure you have that thing available to them like comms console for instance yeah uh, a single desk can connect to three blackboards believe it or not break on towel yeah what is going on with you anyway what i can't believe i Did i never click that down i could have sworn when i was going through earlier i said put one of those down but i guess maybe i didn't i mean obviously i, I didn't click it through i think what was gonna what was happening is i was expanding this i'm gonna put it there after i just never did never did Good old fashioned whoopsie At least it's fixed now. Multiple desks can connect to the same three as well. Yep. So three blackboards connect to your desks. Pretty trivial to you. Yeah. Yeah. As long as you have everything that they could want to do and you have uh, a desk connected to three blackboards. Yeah. You, you generally cap cap it out. Like, no, why'd you have to spawn in as an 81 year old, huh? How dare you be born when you were born? Planted on your map. You're doomed. You only got one guy that can shoot. Oof. Um, how many mechs are on it? Can kids use guns? They can, yeah, yeah, three, they can use guns. They're not good at it. You can give it to them. How wide do you build your concrete factories? 13 by X rooms that I connect basically into major rooms. Usually I start out with four 13 by 13s connected. Exterior. <laughs> Mini guns for all five year olds. So let's go ahead and roof that for the winter. be a long one no matter run no we just started yeah this is very early on very early they're bolt goods all right they're gonna be eating mushrooms at least so that's nice that's nice and we need to get that warmed up in there um Always use kids as grenadiers years of snipers in safe positions. Take this 50 caliber and hunt down that centipede. <laughs> You've been freeloading long enough, child. All right. So temperature in there is now too warm, but just have them not re that. Still cool in here, even with two, because I want to hold the door open. We could do a third one. But we need even more wood. I get that replanted too. The deserter. It's very tempting, but we just don't have the food. The thing is, like, this guy's gonna come with a gun that can be very useful. This character might be really good. We'd have to re-ally the Empire later. We might actually get some prisoners from it. I have to convert this guy too. I'll I'll hold it just in case. The yarn for the mines. What's the grow season? It's 3060. 3060 Boral Forest, basically. It's like 30.6 or something. <laughs> it's effectively 30. All right. Mood is getting better, though, now that they are eating mushrooms. We're get, getting those replanted. 69 degrees in there. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Mushrooms do rot a little bit faster than uh, than rice and stuff as well. So we could make a little uh, cool room for this, especially with animals coming in during the winter. So I think I'll do that. I usually don't, but I think I will. Oh, you don't have to worry about all these freaking animals are running in, trying to freeload off of us, you know? Animals always freeloading.
maximum level reach. Stuff, stuff, and stuff. Tier 3, 67. 67. <laughs> Crazy. Uh, Tina Arena just resubbed for 68 as well. You guys have been here forever. Thank you, stuff. I'm free. You're free loading. Uh, thank you, stuff. Much appreciated. Watching Perry persisted on YouTube. That was a fun run. Yeah, we just finished it up, but it, it was fun. Animals and kids are freeloaders. Write that down. <laughs> More you know. More you know. I need a lot of wood. A lot of wood. How are we doing on conversions here? Uh, they're starting to get there. When he wakes up, I think we'll use the convert thing on him. Uh, body modder, so he's gonna want a right arm, but I mean, we can't get him one for a long time, but. Kids are parasites. My daughter's not listening. There we go, mushrooms are growing again. Nice. Nice, that is done. So we are going to put that as uh, are all fungus and meat. That should do it. Now we just kind of chill. I don't want to get too much uh, wealth or anything. Looks like Randy raids right now will probably be between three and six pawns, depending on what he rolls. Should be able to handle that. Egg arms don't exist in the base game. If you have a mod that adds a peg arm, then it should work. Because peg legs work. Dentures work. No peg arms in the base game. Wooden hand, but he doesn't have an arm to put it on. Wooden hand, yeah, but... There's nothing... Or did it attach it to the shoulder? Yeah, there, there are wooden hands, but not, uh, not wooden arms. Yeah, yeah, we'd attach to the shoulder. Split stream today? Yep, split stream today. Yep. It's my strong hand? Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, so bar, we're going to go ahead and use convert on you. 6.2, nice. What is the breakout interval? 78 days on average, so pretty safe, pretty safe. Yeah, it's wooden arms from Plasteel Surgery mod, do you think? Grab my strong hand. God. I haven't seen that in forever. Forever. Uh, Barracks is that very impressive? Uh, this is that somewhat impressive. That should be good enough for now. So now we just kind of sit back, um, survive, wait on more colonists, and wait on some research. So during that, let's take a look here. So I'll probably do no kill box this one too. Just That's just my preferred way to play and we didn't roll anything that would go against it. So I'll probably end up doing that. Um, which means our bottom wall will have to be right there. Hey, conversion already. Conversion already, look at that. Is that, that's the name of ours? The Ro I'm gonna go with Rogaine Army, but we misspelled it. The Rogaine army. That's us. All right. So I think I'm actually going to recruit them. We need a cook. We need a doctor. They're only one armed, but you know. They'll eventually get an arm. They're a hard worker. I know I only have one arm, but I make up for it with hard work. No, you really can't. That's a ableist. I didn't say it. It was RimWorld that said it. Anyway, back. let's go and recruit them. Your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated. Killbox get nerfed. <laughs> you be the drummer. Rogaine army, no wonder things keep getting hairy. Ah, squared 60, one month. Let's go on R squared. It's a long time, man. That's a third 60 plus month resub today. Jesus. Uh, thank you, R squared. Welcome back. back. This one, I guess we'll just enslave. Fourth? Wait, there was four. 
Oh yeah, yeah, because stuff just did it. Stuff just did it as well. That's right. Fruit them. I need to cook. Anything to research, so. All right, now it's getting real cold out. Real cold. That's just happening, and we're seeing the doctor comes in only one arm. I'm gonna get this area ready for uh, mushrooms as well. Let's just wait till the research is done. I don't know. We have a lot of mouths to feed with just that. That's, that's 157 Nutrifungus. Uh, so that could feed like six or seven people. Yeah, we're cutting it really close. I think it'll be okay though. <laughs> Things you hear when you enter RimWorld stream. Shelf. August pace, nice combo. Yeah, yeah. What is it? It's Raskin. Uh, Ray's been pretty active. Um. I'll say you're the door set horizontally beside the other door. It's so that if something gets dropped, that it doesn't hold open both doors. So a lot of times, like when they're bringing something in, if I draft them because I didn't know, they'll drop what they're holding. But this way, it'll only hold open one door, and I don't have to worry about it. Going melee against rats is better. You'll have this answer. It depends. Well, we don't have a doctor, so even a bunch of rat bites could be really fatal. Especially if someone, get, someone gets an infection right now, they're probably just dead. Probably just dead. Okay, Nick Winter. Yeah, it can last up to 40 days when it's not a quest one. It's kind of crazy. Quest ones can last longer, but non-quest ones are 40 days. 40 days of volcanic winter. Up to, I should say. Uh the dog can haul now, so let's let the dog go in the work zone as well. Hold that door open. Yeah, I'll update that. It looks like this is going to be a stable run, though. But maybe a relatively standard run. This one goes really well, and we just ease through it. We'll do another RNG run. Yeah, pretty much three seasons, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. For a reason, tall base. No, just starting it out different, just for fun. Just for fun, no uh, no actual strategic value in making it taller than I usually do. Look, as soon as I put the mushrooms out here to cook faster, this happens. <laughs> what happens? Shooting experience happens, that's what it is. Whoa. whoa. Screw it. I'll just reopen it if a raid comes, I guess. I'll just reopen it if a raid comes. Pretty risky, but... Inside. What's the temperature in here now? We got up to 44. I might have to have them just wear these clothes during the winter. They're a nudist. They're not going to like this. 
They're also our moral guide, but better than dying. Invasion! Alright, so... I can't do research. Uh, having a slave in the colony makes our other people happier, so that's good. We need a little slave room for them, though. Um, They're pretty terrible aside from crafting. Pretty terrible aside from crafting. Hmm. A little slave room, huh? Hmm. This is a standard run. You technically should run. I mean, it's an it's everything is randomized, so everything is randomized. Um. Do it this way. Psychic drone. Okay. Fast way to convert them. Good room or poor room. They changed it so they convert faster if they're happier. Used to. Uh, there's. You can still torture them and, and hope they have a, a change of faith breakdown. But I find it better just to make them happy. I play Vanilla Extended Storytellers. No, this is Randy. Actually, should run. We'll tell you what's going on or the or the title, of the stream. Either one. Either one. No stream needs? What the stream need? I don't know. Tell me. Makes them convert some other religion for you. Well, the thing is, you want to have them have the crisis of belief once when they're already high up to hopefully get them lower down to get them converted quicker. So if they're like at 80% and they have a crisis of belief down to 30, then you use your conversion, you know, that sort of thing. But a hole in the middle and looked a bit like an old Sesame Street character. <laughs> RNG Storyteller. Yeah, Randy Random. Random, like random number generator, RNG. Randy Random Number Generator. Great Door's purpose, it's so they don't get held open. We don't need this one now, but well, we don't need this one. So if something's dropped there, it doesn't hold it open. All right, copy this. That'll be our crappy slave room. I'll make people a little bit happier. Let's go on Misu. Welcome in. Another granny? I my dear old granny used to say. She was always saying this. Wait. There's so many quotes. Okay, so R squared to them. All right. This is my first time touching this. We wait for the limb to grow back. It's sustainable. Come on. Wasn't there some Stockholm going on here? Not the greatest of grannies. Not the worst, though. Come on, Rakes. Yeah, I thought Rakes' quote was part of it. First two. Uh, all right. So I'm also going to throw down a butcher table. Just building different. It's a good one. Drop hot human leather back to faction after they raid you. Yeah. My thought process on that is like, I'll say, oh God, we should, we should be friends with them. They're crazy. They super crazy. Right. Yeah, just building a little bit different just for fun. All right, Kyle's enslaved. He doesn't even get a name. Craft slave. There you go, craft slave. Enjoy your life or not. Valuable oh, human leather for free. Such a waste of value. Can't even use human leather in this one because of our random roll. <sighs> Another manhunter pack. At least we're already in, so. 
Already in. These are closed. Wolves this time. Lots of manhunters from Randy today. Lots of manhunters. Crafter. Ugh, do need more animals? No. Matter for deep drilling and production or only speed? The amount of extra that you get from a good miner, mining in general, isn't that important. Um, I have a guide that we wrote up about, uh, or that I wrote up about. Hang on. Hmm. I carried three rats for seven days. Uh, anyway, and uh, we tested. Humps is always tough. Tough, fast walker. And it... Oh, seven plants. I think I'm going to do this. Uh, it ended up not really mattering that much, honestly. As far as, like... They get a little bit more, but it's mainly the, per the speed that you want. We do need another plant here. It sucks. Another person that can't research... Yeah, we really need another plant here. We have to keep these rats safe for seven days. That's more food. Man, oh man. Man, oh man. We're going to have to go hunt. All right. Uh, I might just kill this dude in that, but we're really bad at hunting or yeah, in general. Mushrooms will be back in soon. Uh, let's see if we can get this kill. Kill that yak. Yeah, this is gonna be, be tough going. Maybe that one won't have scar or uh, won't insta rot from Scaria. We can hope it's probably going to, but two. Horses are pretty easy to hunt too. That one's leaving the map. These can aggro as a group. It's a herd that can aggro. These can't. Maybe we'll go down there. I gotta get more uh, more mushrooms down. Even if we just uh, need more wood. Yeah, shed did what I usually do and just stayed stayed low for a little bit longer. We're good. We're risking the run for a good colonist. We'll see. See what happens. Biocoded. Okay. Yeah, I mean, even if we just make it out of the wood for right now, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Uh, we have a little bit more. Yeah, screw it. I'll, I'll put more doors in later. Okay. Okay, don't need that anymore. And this person gets a real... Hey, we have an actual doctor. Oh my god. And a cook. Christmas miracle. Okay, let's get Bar a name, and then we gotta go into food collection mode, big time. It's Waffles. This might actually be Waffles' first name ever in in the in the runs for all this time. Crap, Waffles. Oh, why when it comes to doctors? Yeah, because we do need a, a doctor. Yeah. So I kind of was like, ah, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Slightly less likely to die. Well, it might starve to death, though. So now we're going to put this up a little bit. I 
Major break. Numbing cold, slept in the cold. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know. Oh god. Let's hold that open. There we go. Fame at last. Waffles, you're in. Waffle urine. That's right. Is that syrup? Sure. I will tell you're uh you're only one, okay. Sky Dream on a giant pile of rock corpses got lung rot. Right? Nine thousand, that's crazy. Like I said, even if we just make this out of wood for now. I just I just gotta get something in there. We can replace it later. Place it later. Drake on, yeah. Baby crying times two. Okay. Um, Neutrofungus. Yes, I know it'll die when exposed to the light. Thank you. Stone there. The baby into baby food. Monster. Uh, all right. Event there. And there's an animal we can try to kill. Oh my god! How bad of a shot! You you're like touching the animal with a gun. <laughs> How do you miss that? <laughs> It's the recoil, sir. Recoil. It's like a, it's like a twenty-two. Uh oh, that's way harder than that. All right. Slave rebellion, likely. Yeah. Why don't you try it? Why don't you try it? You don't have enough terror. Hang on a second. Terror. Smell some terror. There. How's that for terror? <laughs> like one of those XCOM percentages, yeah. It's a little bit better. A little bit better. Alright, get some mushrooms down. Those ones came in. Uh, temperature is okay to grow in there. Okay. So, hopefully now we can, uh, just kind of coast and get some of this stuff done. Wait, only one of those guys have a skull? Preposterous. There's no way we can kill the thrombos of these guys. Very, very risky. Demon Shrine. Yeah, <laughs> name it, sir. They are a, kind of a genetic wimp, yeah. Delicate wimp. Oh, those rats are eating so much of our food. But hopefully it'll be worth it. We'll get a good pawn of it. Get a good pawn out of it. Got some more mushrooms about to come in. Okay. So we're going to plan out a few things. I don't think I'm going to go into side casting this one. Like Maybe if we get a bunch of... Um, tribals will do it but for now i think i'm just going to decide that's going to be our wall that section and we'll encompass this geothermal welcome back your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated it's like long term if we survive long term if we survive long term Yeah, we're gonna have a weirdly shaped base this time. That's all right. That's the worst that could happen, right? That's what I always say, and it always comes back to bite me. For some reason. Can't explain it. What's with all the friggin' manhunters?
Okay. Johnny Tightlips, 15 months. Thank you, Johnny. 1.25 calendar years almost. Try on. This is uh, Boral Forest. So bad to years take so long to get more than one person. Oh, well, we can get more with a burn box. Randy's right, telling me to try to tame Thrumbo. Oh. Thing today for Randy. He's been pretty active in general, but yeah, Manhunter's definitely been uh, predominant major event of choice for Randy today so far. All right, let's keep planning some stuff out while we can. Hmm. Yeah, this is going to be a weird one wedging in there. That's fine. We'll make it work. Probably should have settled down here instead, but... Eh. It's fine. I mean, we could do wood there, but it's got its own problems, right? So, so eventually, set all this up. Okay, and then, uh, I think I might do an initial burn box to get more. Do I have joint events? So, I might do an initial burn box somewhere. Maybe like right here. Something small. Grab a bunch of prisoners are right here. Maybe. Maybe. And a raid at the same time. Um, they're preparing, so we're going to open this. Hey, this will be the end of the run. We don't have to worry about it. Waffles, grab that knife. Craft slave, grab that wooden club. Uh, 275, kind of a lowish roll. Frag grenades, we don't have any of our traps. All right. Oh, whoops. Go ahead and make that one. Maybe we'll die and we'll get to start over with a different ideology. Sounds good to me. All right, here they come. Yeah, this is actually really dangerous for this. Like, actually. This could be rough. We're only going to have one trap. Oh, man. They immediately... They immediately got the frag grenade off. And got... I have no... Oh, the door was outlawed. Waffles dead. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. No. Wait, all this time to get in the queue. Now I'm just gone. Oh my god, all those components. Yeah, well, 
Turns out there's no inside right now, so. I should have done what I usually do and put a block there so that Manhunters didn't use up all their traps. Shoulda, woulda, coulda, didn't. Just have that one big bleed. Oh, man, black. I haven't seen that in a very long time. Wrong one. Uh, let's see. Zimmerman. Yeah, I know, I know. Don't fail making these walls or everyone's dead. No pressure. Okay. Rescue... Um, shut the door. That door. It knows it's 17. What a mess. What a mess. Um, Maligno's dead. Our 81-year-old that we started with that we didn't want. Dead. Dead. <laughs> Alright. There's a mad rat. Gonna get warmed up there too. Crassley, we don't really care about them as much. Uh, so they're down, they're at serious now. Don't go outside. Factions, they're probably dead too. Our ideology dies out, then we, uh, this is run with RNG done. Steadily cold, yeah, it's very cold. Type theory. I don't uh, I don't have anything else we can do about it and he also can't really make stuff I mean I guess I can have him throw down another campfire just temporarily the heat up uh, let's see I've been fed Move that bed over. We have to risk getting them. Go. All right, so that infection, though, is probably going to die. We got to at least live with one of our, uh, one person from our ideology. They stole most of the medicine. That proximity warmed? No, I just warmed the room. Yeah. Always wanted that so that like you could stay outside by a campfire, but yeah, temperature just room related. Yeah. Uh, refugees. Maybe, maybe. Like, we'll see, we'll see. We'll see what kind of, uh, man, he's also really bad at doctoring. Let's see if one of the refugees is good at doctoring. Uh, we'll go back. We'll go back through this in a minute. All right. Uh, they won't betray us because they have a child. They have a child that can't uh, betray you, so that's good. Infection. 
Medical two, medical three, medical six. Okay. So Harry, I might have to just go ahead and give her a peg leg. Two peg legs sounds terrible, but. Nice. Fight the rat. Thank you. All right, let's see what the tinning quality is, and we'll go from there. Uh, that tin is really good. We also have a preach health when Gribbly is up. Should I actually make it? Oh, right. Never mind. Oh, no, no. I was right. Gribbly is the moral guide. Okay. Rude leg. Give me two legs. Just a suggestion. All right. Uh, let's get this crap hauled out of here with these visitors that cleaned up. Okay, firefighting, patienting, bed rest, child care, one, basic. One item, any of them on that. Cooking, okay. Uh, growing, yeah. Okay, let's see if we can uh, get a few things done while they're here. All right. If we can rebuild or not. Maybe not. Slaughter? Tal I can't really attack her either. She's so close to dying. She's going to fail the quest. Well, no humps for us. That sounds weird. Oh, she's over it now. I don't want another person on my map. Well, you don't have to worry about it now. Craft slave. Don't care. Don't care about him. A slave? No, I no. <laughs> I, I know he's there the whole time. I'm not doing it. Don't really care about them that much. And uh, we can't really feed them or anything at the moment. It's fine. We'll get another crafter or a genie or whatever. They're not a very good pawn otherwise. Slow learner is like one of the worst things. Okay. Uh, construction. Let's go ahead and just have someone dig this grave. Me two of them, actually. Oh my god, we're having the child soap. Dig a grave. Name him Smurf before he dies. Alright. So, waffles and maligno. Okay. I was trying to stop on YouTube and it was really good. Thanks for the info on there. Uh, thank you for watching over there and for letting me know. Appreciate it. Yeah, she's actually beating these now with Preach Health and that doctor coming in. So I actually be able to turn this around. Perhaps her hips. Oh, this leave actually got up. I don't think I'm going to worry about saving them. We're maxing out the adaption, that's for sure. Okay, so waffles needs buried. That'll help us get the mood up a little bit. All right, waffles. We can do a funeral as well, as long as it goes well. That'll help. Could have taken their skulls. Just a little bit of blood in the room. Just, yeah, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Yeah, I should have done that with the trap tunnel like I normally do. I'll I'll do it after, if we can uh, get everything back to 
some kind of semblance of normal. Let's give me to see the mod player. Actually, she mods. I hardly use mods though, so it's not a not on this. Yeah, I was actually looking at that go juice too. Yeah. I might do that when they when they wake up. I wish one of them could actually build. But we're gonna have to work on or wait on Gribbly for that. Uh we'll also put plant cutting on four on these visitors. I wanna miss. What a mess we've gotten ourselves into. Why you never play Darkest Dungeon? Um, because when I play Darkest Dungeon, my viewer count goes down to one-fifth of what it is with RimWorld, and um, the stream is the only thing that pays the bills and buys food and stuff for my family. So it's a job. It's a fun job, but it's still a job. I still have to think of it in that sort of regard. So that's that's the main reason. Like, uh, as an example, on Sunday, I had 1,100 viewers. With, like, that was our, our top without, without uh, like, raids or anything. Uh, and when I switched to other games, the primary game for a week, uh, some days my top in was 108 people. So, pretty, pretty big difference. Pretty big difference. Uh, I'm going to destroy things in the environment. Okay. Yeah, I'm streaming as a job, so if I'm playing a lot of world, you can bet it's because it's good for the stream or the channel. Well, it would be the same with other games. It takes time. Yes, I understand, yeah. RimWorld wasn't my primary game for a long time. That's <laughs> supervisor, no. <laughs> Definitely not. Victoria, hurry up and get over this. Missing wood, yeah, yeah. You no, know, I, I, I can't just play whatever I want. A generous so. I tried that for a few weeks and uh, it doesn't work. Funny thing is, the, the channel used to, uh, the primary game used to be Darkest Dungeon back in the day. But it switched over time. Zombie Survivors, yeah, that should be fun. You stream for money? <laughs> yes. Uh, for the 188 bits. Thank you, Alias. Why don't you just stream for the love of it only? Can't pay the bills with love. I've tried. <laughs> I've tried. Keep getting arrested. Uh, I don't have any books out at the moment. You're talking about one of my wives? One of my wife's books? Uh, yeah, they're still up. A kind gesture. I think Exhibition Book or Exhibition Books might still get a link to some of them, but it's been a while. We try paying the bills with exposure. Ah, <laughs> uh, T Far Squared. They were 65 bits. It's Exhibition Book. Oh, they don't exist anymore. I must have not transferred those over. Wives or wives? Here, I'll, uh, I'm making a note to update that command. All right, uh, Gib, what happened to that weapon area? Wives or wives? Okay, so. All right, we really need to get all this uh, wood done. Well, the good thing is we have adaption factor maxed out, so the next raid will probably be pretty low raid points. Love your wife, your daughter more. Not, there's no, there's no answer to that. What? It's a weird question. Nadra, I, I, I appreciate it. I appreciate the concern, but trust me, everything you can think of like that. Oh, why don't you just try a game similar to RimWorld? Yes, I've done that as well. Yeah. That's one reason why we're doing split streams, though. But Like, I have a Discord channel that is hidden where all we do in there is talk about the business side of things and what to try and numbers and... I spend so many hours every week looking at numbers and looking at stats and 
Play games, the upcoming games. Yeah. All those things. Alright. Be done answering those questions. All right, let's get that table back up so we can get some similar to mood here. Grass slave finally did. Uh, we have the kid dig another grave. Oh, I turned him off from graves after that. Um, soap. Dwarf fortress. I didn't like dwarf fortress. And numbers were not better than not that comparable to RimWorld, so. A lot happened. A lot did happen, yeah. Consume. No, don't consume him, kid. We don't care about these guys breaking down and stuff. I just want them to help us get uh, their feet back on the ground, and then we can go from there. Another mad rat. Oh, my God. It sure is. I'm not complaining about it. People just, that's one reason why I don't like talking about it on the stream sometimes. People are asking me things about it. The question is, why aren't I playing something other than RimWorld right now? That is that is true. That's literally true. That's what I'm saying is I play RimWorld, which is awesome. I'm very thankful for it. I'm glad it's it's a job. It's still a fun job. It's, you know, it's a job. I get like 800 to 1,000 viewers. And then if I switch over, I think it's chat. If I switch over to something else. Um, like if I had gotten up this morning and like, all right, I'm going to stream any other game. I'd probably be at like 150 viewers. It is what it is. I know a lot of people like kill to have 150 viewers. I understand. 150 viewers is not enough to feed my family, so. Uh, is it just the... Yeah, I think it's the visitors that are getting that. I don't really care. They're going to be gone soon. I just really want them to help us get everything cleaned back up. Had a craft slave die. Um, we actually lost two of our main pawns and craft slave. I just let them die because I don't really care about them that much. But the two main pawns died in an explosive pirate raid. I clicked the kite away from the frag grenade and forgot I had outlawed the door over there. And so they went the wrong way and got hit by a grenade. These things happen. Leave the, the stream set to RimWorld no matter what I'm playing. <laughs> All right, uh, yeah, let's get more wood chopped up. We're using so much wood because we're keeping things warm with that right now. I thought we would just rush to thermal, but then I got caught. I got caught waiting on that. So I could have just went to other, um, other power sooner, but oh well. Oh God, Victoria, get down here. A lot of things I was meaning to do that I Stop doing because I was talking and thinking. Games are day, doomsday, and triple rocket launchers are annoying. The doors are world so they can define some of your lives. Fine, overlaid. Whatever you're actually playing. <laughs> Maybe. Alright. So she lived, didn't have to take uh, her leg or anything, so that's good. That's good. Things are getting cleaned up, repaired. Those are getting replanted. Starting to get some semblance of uh, of okay again. Victoria, we're gonna have you eat a meal, then do this go juice, and then we're gonna have you cut down a bunch of trees. The rats die. Yeah, there was a slaughter breakdown, and I didn't want to risk killing her because she was already. She already had two infections and didn't want to arrest her or beat her up, so we just let her kill the rat. Unfortunate, but.
All right, now I'm going to fix this tunnel. Like I said, I was going to do... Um, let's make any stone block. Do forever. It's one of those right now. Drop on the floor. Yep. Yeah, the, rat, the quest rats died, unfortunately. Due to a slaughter breakdown. I guess that's kind of it's better than them taking out the dog it's also relatively easy catharsis but man it is still cold in there even with six camp or five campfires pretty cold map a little over halfway to geothermal mood is starting to head in the right direction again she's gonna be pretty upset about maligno dying for a while at least they weren't like in a relationship but Trying to get the barracks back up. It's somewhat impressive. You get the random ideology. Uh, it's basically slaver tunnelers that like light weapons. This is a Boral Forest map. That's where our mushrooms are. Yep. I've already done that. I just throw on the barracks. It doesn't travel that far like that, really. Not really. But yeah, usually on Boral Forest you can get through the first winter pretty easily with just campfires and then get the geothermal deer in that, but we had a we had a setback. A little bit of a setback. I gotta, I gotta decide if I'm gonna keep this man in black or not. Jogger, cooking, social. We need to convert him if I'm gonna keep him. Go ahead and start working on that. We're not gonna name him until we uh we decide. Well, this is good too. You actually have him butcher without caring. The rest of our colony would care, but, you know, we butchered human-like, only stack so much. All right. Um, we're only the 9th of August, okay. So we have... Growing period doesn't start back until, like, April, Mary, I think. It's better September. September to April, Mary. Is All right, slow and steady. Get back in it. No execution either. <laughs> That's so ridiculous. Uh, I guess we should arrest one of these guys and they're leaving. Execute them. Maybe. They helped us get back on track. We're just going to kill them. Hey, you know. Sometimes you just got to do it. For plus three mood, you know? That's ah, a six mood swing. We don't get the minus three, and we get a plus three. Uh, Super Yoshi. Back. You're the four of once. Your steadfast Thank you, Yoshi. Is greatly appreciated. All right, plenty of wood now. Uh, and yeah, let me let me do this. I don't have that to actually shut, which will help. Yeah. Why am I growing shrooms? Because we're tunnelers. Tunnelers get unhappy if they eat any vegetable other than mushrooms. Tunneler. Fungus preferred. Any other non fungus plant? Minus three. Low food, yeah, I don't know it. Construction botch. Oh no, I didn't turn that little kid off from uh, construction after he dug the graves. Okay, dribbly, I'm gonna break down. Friend died, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's, it's just now hitting the coldest part as well. Sun lamps and it's what our people want, you know. Sorry, Flamingo. Can't leave home right now. Okay. 
All right. Have it done there. We'll uh, get this set back up. I'll help a little bit. He has catharsis, which is nice. More bad. Let's get rid of the awful one. We can use those for some of the guests. I really don't care, though. I'm not going to be here for very long. Down to 136. These people are eating so much food. I think now that we've cleaned up, we should use them maybe to try to kill some animals on the map and then get them out of here. Ah, uh, yes, send the children, child, out to, uh, to melee a bear. Ah, oh, that'll be fine. It's the worst that could happen. Excellent. There you go. Yeah, bring that bear home, kid. Using fins by traps from spawns from getting stuck? No, it makes enemies walk over the traps. So enemies try to take the route that doesn't slow them down. Going over a fence would slow them down, so they choose to go over the, tr the traps. Um, and then pawns can move diagonally, so they don't trigger their own traps. And you don't have to build extra doors that way, because raiders, when they break, will break the doors, and doors are just more expensive, more resources and stuff. Yeah, the fences are to force raiders over the traps. Baron Null, you got the five gift subs. Thank you, Baron Null. Very much appreciated. Much love to the Baron. Yeah, that's why uh why I use the Nulls. Alright. A little bit of meat from the bear. I guess lost pretty far away, but maybe we don't care. What's random ideology? We're basically slaver, required slaver tunnelers that like light weapons. That's, that's the biggest ones. We randomize all the memes as well, so. We're supremacists, but we don't have shooting specialists. Uh, I'll have to update the command at the end of the stream. If we survive this, I thought we were about to die just a minute ago. We actually got really close to dying. Really close to dying. I think I still will send them after that Mega Slaw. Don't be trying to convert us. Speaking you know, of, that up? Disease infection on Victoria? Okay, don't care. Zero tin quality. I better have them go hunt that mega sloth before they leave, before they die and end up leaving. leaving. You know, Red Mountain for bugs. I haven't checked. I'm sure there are in some of these little hills. But Fun Lady of the Mead Hall, welcome back. Tribal traders are bummer to get. Yeah, I try. I usually try to anger all the tribes. That's one of the reasons. Yeah. Oh god. Your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated. <laughs> well. Well. I don't worry about that anymore. Now our people uh don't like human meat. Now, unfortunately, um, one of them was carrying two meals when they fell. So, now rabbits are eating one of them. Oh, whatever. I'm not going all the way out there. Get frostbite. Imagine not enjoying a succulent human steak. Uh, heck it. Thank you for the lurk. Thank you for the two months as well. Heck it. All right. Oh, no. I failed the quest somehow. Somehow. Through no, through no fault of my own, all the visitors are dead. No fault of my own. A 
All right, I wanted to insulate or uh, imprison one to execute for mood. Well, too late for that. Heard stick instead of steak. We do need a prisoner to execute. Current ideology. I need to update the command. Um, yeah. You do it. That's good enough now. Raids are quite a bit smaller now. So execution memes now. So hopefully we can get a uh, prisoner out of this at least for the execution. I have to let it get cold in here for a little bit. Let's see. Slave required tellers is like human meat. Like light weapons. Yeah, that's pretty much it. It's good enough. Uh, no, we should be fine with that number. Yeah. It's like four altogether. groups i don't think so no oh no not, not enough rate points for that after all that adaption let's get some shooting experience here it was all melee right Execute for the mood. Yeah, let's have the uh, the new mother do it. Yeah. Uh, dead in four, dead in three. We can get some medical experience out of this. Probably. And we'll set to rebuild these traps this time. Uh, that was at two. That was at two. Well, let's just execute this one. So. Smash the door there instead of just turning around. It, it's because they try to get to the, the closest edge of the map from them. And they don't care about doors. Yeah. So even after building that one, when they break here, they're going to end up breaking that door. So I should probably get rid of that one too, but I kind of need that door. Yeah, they have like the plus eight animal gene or whatever. Great animals or whatever. All right. Uh, get those skulls and then we'll put them out. Side. I'll help mood a little bit. Uh, 
we never ended up having the funeral either. It's awfully cold out there. So I guess we'll be waiting on that too. All right. So we're back down. We still have two of our starting colonists, but we're back down to basically a start. Going to undead, undead ants. Welcome in. Sora, welcome in. Eyes blocked, snails, bear null. Going hypernova. We knew the 81 year old columns that we had and cable violence. It, it's actually better that they died because they were adding raid points and they weren't really helping us. So if all the ones die, that one's uh, that was really fun. Going back down in raid points while we're getting this research done is also pretty nice altogether, I would say. Mushrooms are coming in soon. Should survive that as well. Another granny. What am I doing? Granny used to say. You gotta give her the meat. Understood, Granny. I'm on it. Uh, what are you on exactly? Never mind. Ask your mother. Why are you always tell me to ask my mother? Granny's telling you to butcher the corpses. No, <laughs> she would. She would. How old is this baby now? Two. Another raid. Another preemptive. 187. A little bit smaller than the last one. Okay. So uh, a lower Randy roll. Randy can roll 0.5 to 1.5. It looks like he rolled under a 1.0 that time at least. I don't know what it what it is, but. Anyway, we have enough traps for these ones, so it should be should be fine. Let's take a gander here. Underground, asexual, Neanderthal. Neanderthal are slow learners, so I don't really want any of them. Delicate Neanderthal. But Um We can execute them for mood though. It's a bunch. Three deaths. Yeah, well two real deaths, I guess. And uh and one slave death. You're saying that the slave that died wasn't a real person? I am saying that, yeah. Our room world's saying that, not me. Sorry. That's the room world's. Um. Get a little bit of medical experience here. A little bit of medical experience and then we'll kill him. <laughs> My crafting real life to use contracts. I usually do everything myself. I actually just rewired all of, put in new and rewired all of the um, smoke alarms in the house. But it, it depends on what it is, but. Like, for instance, I had someone build our fence because I didn't want to even attempt that, but yeah, it depends on what it is. But I did just put in a bunch of wired smoke alarms. For instance. All right, execute them. Excellent. Take their skull. Now let's take a look here. Sir Sleep, Conversion Resentments. My friend died. My friend died. Ah, you'll get over those. Don't worry about it. I might actually go ahead and counsel. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, no, I need to convert this guy. Almost done. The heat out, yeah, yeah. I had to do that when the um, when the raiders were here, just so uh, they would path to us. But conversion, nice. So I guess we'll keep him. He'll get a real name. We'll see who's next in the naming queue. It's none other than answer. All right. Welcome to the colony, answer. What a great place to live. So you are not really a doctor, but you are playing one on TV. Congratulations. 
Uh. Yep. Yeah. All right. Good as is. Probably my playthrough. If not, are you planning to? Uh, yeah, but it's been a long time. And do I plan to? Not in the near future, at least. Will I eventually? Maybe. Hands are slim. Yeah. <laughs> it's animals. The user for decoration. Uh, oh, in real life? No. <laughs> so my daughter can play in the backyard. I thought you were talking about these. It's like... So my daughter can play in the backyard. Without having to worry about anything. <laughs> Another granny. It's like my dear old granny used to say. She was always seeing this. Anything special with these buns of yours? Granny, for the last time, stop talking about my buns. Yeah, they are special. Let's stop talking about them. Ripley. Man, that's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of stuff. String closed, yeah. From where? Uh, okay, what? All right, I'll be right back. Speaking of my daughter, did you get it out? Yeah, it was too big of a piece to go actually in her foot, so it's just a just a small cut. Yeah, she's fine. Thank you for asking. Yeah. We're actually redoing some stuff downstairs, so we am doing stuff myself. Replace the peg leg. If this is a room world, yeah, that would be the that would be the the main uh option, yeah. Glass feet down. Uh, there's a sky god, but I don't see a quote yet. Uh, room world's crazy that way. Crazy that way. All right. Uh, let's see if there's something that we can just give them to lower wealth a little bit. There. Take those. What? That's, that's not true. That's weird. It's only showing you 10 or... Yeah, because you can do one at... You can do any number at a time. Do any number at a time. It's weird. All right. Yeah, it was. Uh, it was luck luckily, I guess, a big enough piece that it just it just cut. It didn't like, you know, it doesn't have a glass in her foot. Oh, I've had that. Are you on track? Uh. So basically two groups of around six imps. Uh, no. no. 
a lot of websites to do that party security over everything. Yeah, that's 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 weird. Yeah, I've never heard that. Interesting. Interesting that that's one of the things it would block. Arm for a couple of years after an accident. Oh, I have a really terrible story that hurts me about something that happened to my mom when I was a kid. I don't know if I've ever told this one on stream. I think I did tell it once. Oh, it's actually like hurting me thinking about it. All right, so since I'm suffering, you guys have to suffer as well. You guys have to suffer too. Man hunters again. Oh crap, I'm going to shut that. Do I have time? Do I have time? Okay. Group suffering, all right. No, 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 this is something that happened to my mom, not something that happened to me. Um. My, at my great-grandmother's house, she had a room, a uh, back bedroom that had been converted into a quilting room, and so she'd quilt in there. And we were uh, cleaning out my great-grandmother's house, and my mom went in there, and we thought everything was cleaned out, and everything was good. And she went down on a knee to pick something up, and a needle, a sewing needle, had been in the floor, and it went straight through her kneecap. She still has the, um, she still has the x-rays. Straight through her kneecap into her knee. Ugh. Ugh. Anyway. Ugh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, screw that. Anyway, she still has the, the x-ray from it. Brutal. Ouch. Ouch. Got the squeamish gene. I have the physical empathy gene. Where it's like, oh, hey, look, tox rats. Rats. That's a needle. The thing is, she had to wait quite a while to have it surgically removed. They didn't do it immediately. So she had to live with that embedded inside of her knee for a while. Finger and sewing machine story. <laughs> Don't want to make lunch anymore. Look at that. It's a way to lose some weight. Mm -hmm. Is that a fish hook at the beach? Yeah, a lot of you guys probably haven't heard the fish hook story. I got one of those if you want. I'm sure a lot of you haven't. I heard it. Some of you have, though, obviously. You've already mentioned it, but... Yeah, I've stepped on nails. That really, that really sucks. I had glass embedded in my foot. It also sucks. Man, we really gotta make sure he doesn't die. My mom's got me a... And versus painting boat. Yeah, I don't know what that would be, but maybe... Tantrum, okay. Hopefully the war merchants come and kill these. So I'm hoping. He passed out due to that many times. Oh no. He shouldn't break the whole thing. I have no one else that can repair it though. Come on, war merchants, save us. <laughs> no, I'm done. I'm done for now. <laughs> So it's a pond and a bunch of snail shells. Ugh. Ouch. Me yet never managed to grow them yet. Yeah, it's good. It's one reason why tumblers are so good. Mushrooms are very efficient. Don't require any light. Actually, you can't grow them with light. Speaking of light, light sitting. Do you remember that eight man raid? Eight individual raid. Uh, I think you light. Those of you joining from light stream. Welcome or welcome back. I'm Adam, it's Adam versus everything. We're doing an RNG run, uh, execution run, we'll tell you more. Mushrooms are efficient? Yeah, because they don't take any light or anything. It's 20 tiles of, of uh, Nutrifungus for colonists for simple meals forever. And they don't take any light, so. Nice, very convenient. Very convenient. All right. Oh God, there's still some alive. And they're all dead. Passed out one time in a hospital, walking down the hall. This is your friend's dad, who was having back surgery. Pain anguish on the face is enough. I have what I call physical empathy. Not really squeamish, but like, sometimes I literally feel like tingly sensation when I see someone get hurt. Yeah, they can't get blighted. Yeah, the only downside to the mushrooms, really, obviously, aside from dying in lights, is that they only last 30 days unrefrigerated instead of 40 or 60. 
Uh, for nutrient paste? I'm not sure how many tiles for nutrient paste for mushrooms, yeah. Not sure on that one. Consulting spree. Listen, I hate to do it. I'm just going to let them do it. Let it happen. Let's go, Pavilion. Welcome in. Uh, this one, it's been... We've lost three colonists already. I thought we were going to the, lose the run. We almost did. Maybe paying closer attention to, but... Kind of... Going through the motions for a little bit. Waiting on us to get stabilized. Insult the guest instead, yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah. We lost, uh, Waffles, our, our cook, right? So. Anzer could get all right at cooking. We'll do that instead. Was there more, that was where our slaves lived. But the slave is dead. I can't believe you died already. Waited all this time, gotten an RNG run. That's probably one of the worst kind of runs to get in if you want to live long. A gift from Northern Korea. Hey, it's a bow. Oh boy. Oh boy. Ambrosia sprouting. Still counts. Uh, Granny summoned. Let my general granny used to say. I've been in the dark my whole life up to this point. She was born with cataracts. It was horrible. Terrible story. Shuttle crash. I, we can't really protect them. Like sometimes as early as a one star, they can basically protect themselves, but rewards are crap anyway. The queue and only see it in one of the VODs or the edited videos or something. Yeah, we're just uh, just kind of waiting now to get things stabilized. Your shell materials. Yeah, that is true. Not a lot though. Oh, right. Crap. I wasn't even thinking, um, so that raid that, that killed almost everyone stole all of our components. Is a double door an airlock? No, it's to help prevent. Did you see like a second ago when there was, um, they dropped mushrooms here? Because of the cold climate, especially if animals can path to food, they'll immediately go to it. I'm trying to make sure, uh, entryways into, oh, right. We're overcooking now. Entry ways into, um, here we go. Oh, wait. I think that was the ones that didn't have mushroom that just rotted. Entry ways into the rooms don't get held open so that all these animals don't, like, run in. <laughs> this baby was cooking for a second. This baby is our greatest hope. We're almost three. Our starting ponds were terrible. It's our only hope for a good pond. <laughs> Maybe. Let's make your... Yeah, yeah, like wild people, yeah. Let's come in like, oh, I live here now. I'll just eat all your food. You what? I'll eat all your food. Yeah, that sucks. That raid stole the 30 components that Crash Landed starts with. 12 wild squirrels. Uh, not for that. Growing, it's time. Uh, yeah, I think the reason why I had it this way is because I threw this together really quick and I just didn't, uh, I didn't change anything from there. Uh, a new but I'll probably do that too. Come steal yourself. I gotta decide if this is how I'm gonna keep it though. Army. Hamsters! Hamsters, thank you for the 20 gift subs. Thank you, hamsters. Where, where you at now? 622. Uh, much love to the hamsters, as always. Just like I'm always saying, much love to the hamsters. This one, we still don't want it held open. Yeah, that'll be fine. Just a for now sort of thing. Yeah, 
Are you getting hamsters? Welcome in, Lucifer. I got thrown both. Well, these cold apps is kind of slow going sometimes. But yeah, we're actually packing in mushrooms now, which is really good. Roll a good ideology. It's not a bad one. It's just kind of just mediocre. For instance, we rolled supremacy, but it didn't roll shooting specialist. Tunneler, but we're not on like a mountain map or anything like that. Slaves, but no human le human meat or human leather. So it's kind of just middle of the road. When you want them to? Oh my god, yeah. You don't want babies though. They're gonna have them like crazy, unless you sterilize them. So they literally can't. Oh my god, we've almost made it through the actual winter. Ask anyone seen any mad rats. An album. And you said I'm four hundred percent no luck. Um, body purist. I really hate. But we can get them to execute because of our ideology. So we also have to execute prisoner at least every 30 days or people going unhappy. So we'll do that. There we go. Get a little bit of mood boost there. You have genies or hair little it'd be OP. Uh, no, I mean, you can't get to the gene extraction. Just try to extract literally the the um, crafting gene if that's what you want them for. You know, so I don't, I don't think I think it'd be fine. All right, we lost our. That's right, our eighty-one year, eighty-one year old was our grower, though. Crap. So I'm gonna have to have one of these do growing. Uh, kind of four rib. All right. Oh, that's unfortunate. Explains a lot, though. Forgot it was the 81 year old one. Let's sell clothes. Crafting is a big priority. Yeah, yeah. Gifts. Sucks they stole all those components. Yeah, we just gotta wait on, uh, wait on more prisoners now. Hmm. Tempting to see what's in there, but it would risk the run entirely. Maybe I don't. Maybe I don't care. <laughs> Use them as time. You longer need them, genies. Hey, we had an old thrombo have a heart attack. Nice. We have such a low pawn count. If we get enough wealth, there's a chance for the, one of the colonies to actually have, uh, one of the trade colonies to actually have um, slaves that we could get. A lot of me to starvation. Oh, the baby. Crap. Um. Um. 
Kind of was just looking for somewhere nice today. Ain't Thrumbo? We will eat Thrumbo, yeah. But our um, primary butcher was is still having a breakdown. Baby was the one starving. Baby can't eat a raw Thrumbo, no. <laughs> Did you break? Yeah. All right, so now we can actually hold this open. Next raid. Oh God. I have the baby still. <laughs> okay, so as soon as it's warm weather enough, maybe we go see if we can dump this. Right. They ended up, um, no, no, no. This one, okay, okay, it's purple. We can, we can do it. The baby has become a child. Hooray. <laughs> God, what a terrible name. So, it's too cold for us to go on that trip right now. Unless we make, we can make a, we can make a park gun and send them. It's great. Let's do it. Meet the child. Well, the child's one of our starting colonists, basically. Uh, do we have anyone that would be able to? Uh, it would be crap anyway, but I mean, it's still warm, right? Yeah, I think we should probably go do that. And then if they don't have someone to trade, we can get um, more components. Um, horses are all gone. How long of a journey is it without an animal? It's only half a day. Right. Can I get that uh research done? I've been going really slow. I feel like this is the community challenge thing. break your toddler you should like darkness for some reason if you like tunnels you should like darkness does make any sense cavers still cave with lights on their head park a shuffle yeah <laughs> So much in wave series. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. They were watching that. Oh, just go in there. We're gonna blend some minerals in doing this. Right. Back. So uh, we could start cooking in there. Turkey self tamed. How do you order a priority? Click chopping. Uh, click them, right click on the tree. Hold shift to issue more commands, to queue up more commands. Hmm. Um, let's actually stop sewing up here for now. Yeah, you can queue up. You can queue up them to do things with shift click. Yeah, not and not just uh, cutting. Oh god, the map doesn't have stuff growing back on it yet. I gotta shut that. Watch out, kid. 
We'll shoot your eye out. Ooh, <laughs> the raccoon's like, they can't kill me if I'm behind that kid. Well, do I have news for you? We barely care, care about that kid. All right. Uh, we gotta get the, uh, stuff up for learning. Alright. Uh, Tal, you're in. Okay, spirits, how about you go... Chop down some of the forest. Animals come in when it's cold. Yeah, it's crazy. They just... Everyone. It's food delivery. It'd be pretty annoying depending on what it is. It's more so during that uh, Everything Explodes run that we were just doing on Sunday. Thank you, kids. Sit on hard stools. Uh, Gribbly. Welcome back. Your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated. All right, get this done. Now we're going extravagant. Ah, uh, vivacious. Thank you for the 13 months. Thank you for that. Very much appreciated. Get at least one of these done. Nicely turn handling down. <sighs> Slow start on this one. Slow start. Sucks we lost all those components. Transport pod. A hussar from the Empire. Dead in four hours anyway. Send me back to the base. I also stole most of our medicine. And most of our silver. <laughs> Birthday. Anzer has reached the ripe old age of 49. Has a bad back. <sighs> Great. 30% moving reduction, 10% manipulation reduction. I have to keep an eye out for a spine. What an inconvenience your bad back is to me. Why don't you ever think about these things? Yeah, I think uh, an answer is the one that we're about to send out as well. Make one parka. Um, <laughs> no one's good at it. Uh, Tal. Make the parka. Oh, man. Uh, I guess we'll make a plain leather. Let's see. Danger? No, I think I'm good. They could just kill the run <laughs> completely. I didn't scrape and scrap to make it through that first winter. Just die to ancient danger. Yeah, there's the command for the, the memes, the ideology. Hey, finish this off. All right. Well, this is going to be a big risk, but... It means I have to put her back on cooking, which she's terrible at. And he's not going to be able to carry a whole lot either. Uh... Oh, well. I'll be gone about a day and a half, maybe. Maybe. Uh, 
Um. Good luck. How does training children work? So basically, the child will have this. Have these icons, which tell it tells you what they currently want to do and what they're going to want to do next. And as long as you have uh, give them access to these things when they want them, then they're going to get higher and higher in growth tier. And a uh, single bench can connect to three blackboards for additional uh, learning rate bonus. Yeah, see how it's connected blackboards three out of three plus hundred sixty percent. Only real children that easy. Just get them what they want. They turn out to be gods. <laughs> yeah, that is not true. <laughs> not in real life. Sucks having to do this with people that have no planting. should allow us to hold the doors open sooner. We gotta get that research done. I should do nothing else other than uh, cook and research at the moment, but pretty much all there is set up to do, aside from growing. Let's turn growing off and then kind of a rough, rough choice though. Very slow going. Going halls tournament. It was pretty good. Yeah. I messaged you back about it. I don't know if you saw. So we're looking for uh, any slaves they might can buy. Answers down. Crap. Ready to tag immediately. I knew that was a risk. He got food poisoning while on his trip. And that combined with the bad back. I don't know that the door was open when these guys first showed up either, so. I'm about to find out. We're gonna make a hole up there. Anzer might not get up in time, but I can't afford to send anyone else. That was a man in black that saved us. Another raid already. Jeez. He definitely doesn't want this RNG run to succeed. Uh, attack immediately. <laughs> Look how small the raids are getting. Uh, okay. Must have been a low Randy roll with that. Whoa, nice hit. Rib. Excellent. I mean, so Don, yeah, that one's a good one too. I played that one on stream quite a bit. Watching the biotech launch run. Those are fun, yeah. It was fun to kind of play around and figure out biotech. Uh, 
I did what? Hmm. Let's see. You know what? Just to make sure I didn't, uh... All right. Well, if Anzer gets up, he does. If he doesn't, well. Do raids count caravan wealth? No, it's just wealth on the map. Wealth on the map only. Ah, oh, man. Hey, he got up. Look at that. Wow, look at you. I thought you were a goner for sure. Okay. They got horses here, too. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, they don't have any people for sale. What do you mean people for sale? Buy that horse and whatever components we can get. Way to go, Anzer. Way to go, not dying. Look at you. The guns. Uh... We're okay for now. I usually roll, I think it's like two to six different guns or something like that, but. My lord. Bandit, please. Franny is awake today. What do we got here? Next time the travel's here, we need to anger them. I need some uh, planters. You're much more likely to get good planters from uh, tribals, so. It's unfortunate we, uh, our people don't like human meat in this run. Oh, I would be, be just fine. Let's get some more shooting experience here. Execute those. Take the head. Yeah, but the problem is we could also just die. This could have multiple centipedes in it. And we're just dead, All right? So right now I'm not uh, not gonna open the ancient danger. Could be something easy, or it could be something that could end the run. Execution, get medical experience. No. Yeah, we gotta get that done. Um, here we go, slowly but surely. Why immediate execute? Our ideology gets um, gets a mood boost from execution while guilty or well, anytime. Is vivisect a mod? Vanilla mod. Best gun to train children with smoke launcher or EMP launcher and have them aim at another colonist or an animal. I think it's the moment. Execution memes will tell you. Yeah, you can actually train shooting on any character by having smoke launcher or EMP launcher and just target an animal or another colonist and it doesn't hurt them, but they'll they'll gain experience. You have to micromanage it, but... Man, uh... Hmm. Yeah, I would almost be willing to anger our only friendly if uh, one of them was good at plants. Abilities elsewhere last night? It's all somewhere I know. Do they allow for it? <laughs> no, I don't. Always, I'm, I'm sure you guys were abiding by whatever rules wherever you were. I mean, put that out there. Crap. Now I don't know where I placed it. All 
All right, Zach just came over from YouTube. Why don't we talk about Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time? Uh, but it's the worst of the of the original trilogy. Nothing else to say about it. Someone else in chat. Oh, I got you. Oh, uh, the tiger rider. Gotcha, gotcha. Go on, Chris. Welcome in. I remember them. Uh, we have to get more wood. Get more wood. <sighs> Mess. Answer. Uh, let's have you doing the research now. Way more than any help that they give you. Yeah, it's kind of crazy when you call in friendlies that it doesn't scale, but the random friendlies do. I wish I wish the ones that you called in would scale too. What a mess this run's been though. Uh, probably should put the horse out. We don't have that much extra food. We can just bounce it around every time it's done grazing in an area. Blow up your defenses, yeah. yeah. Leave doors open, set everything on fire. <laughs> All right, let's get this freaking thing done. Yeah, I wish they would have friendlies never bring flammables. It's so annoying calling friendlies to help you with mechs and like half of them have Molotovs. Well, not much growing period left, honestly. Got like one season left. I think I'm actually going to take this geothermal first. Oh no, they're no longer lactating. It's information that I desperately needed. Hmm. And I'm in. It's been a rough one already. Just slow and steady though. We can we can get there. Fugly. Psychic suppressor. Six point eight days. Five year olds. Come on. Come on, Fugly. Who names their five year old kid Fugly? I uh, didn't name a five year old kid. They named him at birth. Oh. That's better somehow. That's better somehow. Say fugly. It would pair up really well with unwanted child. Unwanted child. And I'm gonna have to go grab some more of this wood. Really should have just done what I usually did and rushed uh stayed in just a little shack and I did anything else till we got to geothermal. But oh well, trying to rush. I got caught. Randy caught me. Named kid unwanted child, that's true. Not my kid though, so it's completely different. Maybe that one was named by someone that didn't have that child, though, too, you know? Be right. Crap. Kid thinks this is a game. Wee! The puppy's chasing me. He sure is.
long time watchers from youtube that's awesome yeah thank you guys for watching over on youtube now over on over on here now here Ugh. kid immediately just goes and lays back down on the trees by the trees I almost got eaten <laughs> that you did kid that you did Oh, what a mess this playthrough's been. Going Finks? Sacrifice childs. I'm in danger. You choose the map prior to knowing what your memes are going to be? I didn't choose anything. The map's random. Do I allow myself to rehome? No. A random map. We have to stick with it. I have to stick with it. Pain doer. All right now. Not right. Swirl force it is. Yep. Yep. All right, that'll help a little bit. Hmm. Been worse, like sea ice. But yeah, yeah. If we had gotten uh, sea ice with this other stuff starting, we'd already be on to another run by now. We were almost, we almost were on another run. But this one, what? Angel turning around at the last moment. As much as it sucked that Maligno was incapable of violence and 81 years old, he actually was doing a lot of important stuff around the colony. It does suck that he he died. And Waffles died. I didn't. So Waffles got downed, but then a stray frag grenade landed on him while he was down and <laughs> finished killing him. Dreams can grow under roofs. Yeah, yeah. I actually did, uh, uh, we did a Boral Forest last Sunday, yep. Yeah. That one wasn't a RNG run, that's a community challenge run. Tribals. You look old. You are old. Oh. Sickly great memory. He's 53. He's not that old. 13 plants. Nine plants. Hard worker. 33. Addicted to smoke leaf. Um. God, I don't even know if we can kill the other ones. Can we arrest Falcon without losing. <laughs> Then we have to wait out his smoke leaf. Mm. Yeah, Royal Force can be good. Loves plants to do smoke leaf. Who knew? So I, I yeah, we really need we really need another planter. Or a planter. We don't even have one. Uh hard worker planter. Man, we're gonna end up trying it, but we might uh, we might lose the run. On it, which is fine. We can just start a new RNG run if that's the case, right? Can I grow a smoke leaf for him? I could, but yeah, it's not really worth it. I'd just rather them get over it. Did it say they were passing through? <sighs> Crap. Haven't seen. I haven't lost a run since Biotech came out. Yeah, but these ones are definitely ones that would we be likely to lose. Tal, okay. Push him to the back. Well, that one's split off. All right, well, this could be the end of this run. Oh no, actually, I controlled her. 
So now I can't actually uh, capture him the right way. So they're probably gonna end up dead and we've done this for no reason. I was trying to get them clicked out of the out of the mess there. Hard worker iron wills. Okay. We'll see. But yeah, yeah. But we'll see. We'll see if I can make it there without having to worry about the bleed. All right, and we anger tribals, so it's a win-win, hopefully. Yeah. I thought they changed that. And I might have gotten Tal dead trying it. This one's not as important that we save. Actually, we don't need that one at all. We'll execute it for the mood. Not for a raid while we're like this, yeah. <laughs> Kids wonder what the crap's going on. Freaking cribs in the way. Yeah, I know there's no light in there, but that's what it is. What'd you miss the past two hours? All uh, a lot. <laughs> a lot. So. It's been a messy run. If we can keep them from uh, breaking down, getting killed, breaking out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I actually get a planter and then we'll be in alright shape. Such happy music for all this craziness going on. Rib weld. Alright, uh start working on converting. Down to 74. Okay. Also, let's make this into a uh prison bedroom instead of a barracks. That'll help them with mood a little bit. So we'll uh we'll store the beds over there if we need them. There we go. I'll leave the good bed out. Okay. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, music in the situation. Will be what DLC would you wish for? So people ask me that all the time. My two big wish list items are uh, performance increases for the game, so the game runs better. My second one is a revamp of like the world and factions and things like that. We should be getting new RimWorld con uh, content later this year, and I say that because the developers have said that. Um. 
Don't know what it's gonna be though. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, I don't I don't I don't know. They haven't told us what it's gonna be, just that there will be new content coming. Late fall, early winter. The mags? Wilderness DLC, I don't know. Do you intend to capture them? What did you do wrong? So if you if you draft someone and arrest and you don't touch the drafted colonist, they'll actually arrest them and they'll go put them in the bed normally. But if you give them any kind of command after the arrest command, they will put them down as not a prisoner. Said you want tribal faction to be hostile. Why are you trying to manipulate how uh, tribals are easier to kill and there are more of them. So you get more human meat and leather if you're going that route, more chances at prisoners and uh, they're easier to kill because they, they don't come with like marine armor or anything, right? So yeah, tribals are just easier raids to kill and there's more, you get more resources from them. Welcome back. Your steadfast loyalty most is greatly uh, Ingboy, 32 months. Thank you, Ingboy. Long time. Long time, Ingboy. Oh, I can't believe we're almost at four hours. Jesus. I feel like we made no progress. Probably because we haven't really made much progress. <laughs> We're gonna do this again. We gotta make sure this gets recruited. This talk to let's look, it's an object. This thing in here. I have to make sure it's recruited. I actually could make it in make them into a slave. We could always free them later. I think I might do that because then we only have to convert. We don't have to worry about uh, getting there. Hmm. Hmm. If you have none of the DLC, you might as well get biotech. It's the biggest, has the most stuff in it. Uh, the DLC that I miss the most when I play with no DLC is ideology, though. Got two. Yeah, we actually had, yeah, we had one of a slave die as well, yeah. The resistance is pretty low already, though. Yeah. Usually tribals are higher than that, but what is that? What do they have again? I'll probably just make them a colonist, honestly. Wait a minute. Oh god, another raid. Uh, the guy in there is addicted to smoke leaf. Anzer just took his smoke leaf out here, smoked it, it's all over him, he smells like it, and then he goes into the prison where the guy's addicted. It's like, uh, you guys got smoke leaf out there? I, I smell it, I, I need it. No, 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 we don't have smoke leaf. We don't do that here. <coughs> Uh, impids. impids. I do that here. Thanks for the help. Make sure you set all our stuff on fire before you leave. Yeah, blow up your friends. Oh, well, well yeah. excuse me. Surgical precision with a frag grenade for a change. Wait. Oh, they set their friend Jess on fire. Sam, you've always hated Stevie. Now's your chance. Jess. Jesus Christ. Wow. <laughs> An assault rifle. Cool. Thanks. Hey. Crap. Answer. Strip. Was there a low shield on this one? Yeah. Hey. It's actually a pretty big pickup. <laughs> a low shield and a, a relatively crappy. Oh, whoops. That revolver was a good one. We get out there in time. We had a little bit of progress. A little bit. A little bit of progress. Okay. So we get 65%. You've used that on cooldown. We, we gotta get this friggin' research done. Yeah, yeah, pretty good. 
Revolve for the kid? Maybe, actually. Maybe. The thing is, raiders will ignore them if they're not using a weapon. So, let's see. Let's see. We got some hodgepodge. Our rifle's big. Yeah, it's going to be very inaccurate because it's poor quality, but it's still range, you know, still decent damage. But the accuracy is going to be garbage. All right. Uh, what's the kid doing anyway? Fine. Down to 52. Wait a minute. We have a neutral... Uh, we're not bigoted, so it's neutral, so we can just recruit them. The downside is they're gonna have breakdowns while they're out because of this. Oh well, let's, let's recruit them. We, we really need people, so. Might regret it, why not? Hey, raw food, yeah, sorry about that. She was uh, nearly dying. Can you imagine complaining about that? Like the the only cook for the colony, your friend, you know, the, the, the single mother of the colony has just been brutally wounded. Someone stabbed her like 12 times with a knife and then she's recovering and you're like, I have to make my own food or I have to eat raw mushrooms. This is such an inconvenience to me. Why don't she get up? She's always laying down. More result in sudden death. Yeah, well, maybe. Yeah, I, I turned off raw food in the last run. I might do it in this one, too. Totally reflects real life. <laughs> Is there a good reason not to recruit? We'll still or uh, convert. We'll still convert, but they can go ahead and be out of prison doing work while we're converting rather than in the prison not getting anything done, you know? It's being a a drain on the colony. So we still will convert them, but they can they can start planting and harvesting and stuff. Uh while that's happening. Uh, they're tribal, so have, there's only a couple tribal backgrounds that don't have natural meditation. This one does. But yeah, I'm not sure if I'll let them do it or not. Maybe. Might as well. I mean, they get recreation from it too, so. Beggars? Well, let's see. Let's see how these beggars can help us. Where are you guys coming in? Oh, here they are. Here they are. Tough, unwaveringly loyal. An unwaveringly loyal beggar in Cable Violence. Slow learning wimp. It's like they're not even trying to get captured. Adam, they're not trying to get captured. Equals organs? Uh, no, we can't. We can't get organs. We have to abide by our ideology in this one. It's in the same house. Always ends up very difficult. Yeah, they can. JXM, tier 3, 23 months. Thank you, JXM. Much appreciated. Man, tier 3, 23 months. Um, yeah, so one of the reasons why this one has gone so negatively is last time I did RNG runs with ideology, I was like, you know what, we'll just ignore it. And I'll play normally and optimally. And if they get unhappy because we're not doing their ideology, so be it. But this one, we've decided that we have to lean into it. So whatever the ideology says, we're going to we're going to try to do. Arrest them and execute them because they're bad traits. I mean, that's not a bad idea. Not a bad idea because our people get a mood buff for, for execution. And that one can't fight us anyway. Wow, well, <laughs> God. Let that be a lesson to you, Falcon. Mm. All right. Trying to recruit be allowed to harvest organs. Uh, your whole colony gets the debuff from it. Whole colony. 
That was a quick execution, just immediately zoop. <laughs> Like cutting through butter, boss. Foo poisoning. Yeah, it will. Uh, it's not from dirty cooking area, if anyone's wondering. You have to have a worse than negative two cooking area to get that. It's just because she's a crappy cook. I don't think it's ever been done that quick. Uh, oh, they almost died. Uh, 2.7. Again, we'll use uh, convert on cooldown. 50. So. Worse than negative 2, do they change it? No, it's how it's always been. It's how it's been since the beta, at least. Uh, waffles, thank you for the 888 bits. Thank you, Waffles. Much appreciated. But yeah, uh, for anyone that doesn't know, you cannot get food poisoning from a meal. You can't get the cooked and dirty cooking area from a meal that was cooked in a room where the cleanliness was better than negative two. So. You're planning on playing Enter the Gungeon again? I don't know. I haven't played that in a couple of years. It's really fun though. I really like it. So maybe my favorite bullet hell game of all time. Enter the Gungeon. I would love to see uh, Enter the Gungeon 2. And just keep hoping, I guess. I was wondering if that was the hardest run you've done in Cable Violence. Uh, oddly, the hardest run still is the original Melee only run. I think the hardest runs I've ever done, the original Melee only, in Cable Violence, and the No Walls. Yeah, I played Bro Rotato quite a bit. Yep. Rotato is a different kind of genre overall than... than um, Thing into the gungeon, but it's 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 good for a, a monster arena survival thing. The mostly elephants run, yeah, both of them. Well, I know of no into the gungeon two at all. Cable okay, of walls. I did a run where I couldn't use walls, doors, or rooms. It was just completely out in the open. It's up on it's up on YouTube. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm 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 meaning like not a spin-off, but like literally. Well, I don't know. Maybe they call, maybe they consider it a sequel, but I mean like another Enter the Gungeon, same same genre. So I think they did kind of what happened with um, Risk of Rain, which I actually liked Risk of Rain one better than two. I know I'm in the minority for that, but they did a completely. It was more like a spin-off with Risk of Rain two, but. That's why we ask if things are walls. Because yeah, if you want to check that run out, it's up on YouTube, both the full VOD and the edited version, where I did an entire run, 500%, hardest difficulty, no pause, no walls, no rooms, no doors. Yeah. It was really, uh, it was a really crazy run. Check it out on YouTube. Surely, surely we're not going to go back to this. Our turrets walls. <laughs> what run is that called? If you go to YouTube and you type in Rimworld no walls, you'll probably find it immediately. Yeah, I really liked Risky Rain. I mean, I like Risky Rain too, but it was a very different game overall. But yeah, let me know if you don't find it searching for that and I will, uh, I'll give you a link, but should come up, I think. Oh, I know you're joking, man. I think you were here during it, if I remember right. Should probably try to kill that bear. Or hunt someone. We'll wait till the daytime, so at least we can kite. I shouldn't have waited on geothermal this time. I just did what I normally do on these maps. Just made a wood generator to start with. Take care of three goats. Grump, the 16 year old pyromaniac. Deathless and fertile. <laughs> All the full VODs are on YouTube as well. Yep, they're still there. 
Go to my YouTube channel and click the live button. And that's where all the VODs are. Brandy signing that your anima tree was too perfect. Yeah. And the funny thing about that is when the anima tree got taken out early, I was like, well, it doesn't matter because we're not going to be able to beat this run on our first try anyway. So I don't care. I don't care that much about it. It's whatever. Oh, the voices that are used to imitate chat. Oh, God. Yeah. Steadfast, loyal. Um, yeah, that's where all the VODs are. And also, if you want a link to specific VODs, they're in the description and the pinned comment of every run. So, like, let's say you're watching the edited parry runs. You're like, man, I wish I could see this whole thing. Well, good news. You can. Uh, the link is in the description and the VOD. Or you can click the live tab like, yeah, like you found there. Oh, nice. Nice. That's why it's a wall. Uh, Red Kinks. I always almost say Nyx. It's been five months and I almost say it still. Uh, thank you for the resub. Much appreciated. Well. Might actually do fine meals from the meat because they're actually skipping eating the meat meals a lot of the time. They like mushrooms. I'll think about it. How's it going, Falcon? You're probably really unhappy, huh? Smoke we leaf withdrawal. But you have very low expectations, so. They're going to get recruited soon. For Dota player, you read Nyx as well, so I'm not the only one. All right, so we're finally going to have them recruit. Oh, God. I'm going to have them recruited pretty soon. Uh, and then... We should be able to finish this research, get the geothermal. And then once we get the geothermal, we'll switch everything off from, um, from using wood. New recruit, Falcon. Congratulations, Falcon. You're unconscious. And then I think we can actually maybe restabilize if Randy chills out. He was really active too, but made some bad decisions early that I don't usually do. Welcome in Sprinkles and uh, paid the price. So it goes sometimes, so it goes. All right, uh, we'll keep working on converting them. And finally, someone that's a grower, not a shower. Uh, what? And they have, look at that, a six in crafting. Good, good. Yeah. Whatever it wants, sometimes it's very wrong, yeah. <laughs> I have this thing that uh, my wife laughs at, that uh, when I see a license plate, like every license plate, I'll just say what the word is that it is, like, and sometimes it's not close at all, even if it's not a word. Like the first word I think of when I see, um, whatever it might be, letters like, you know, G R six five L whatever, and I'll just randomly say a word that has maybe one of those letters in it, and she looks at it expecting it to be a vanity plate, and it's not. She's like, "What? Oh yeah, you see, Georgia." I don't know, does not say Georgia. Georgia. All right, we got someone that's planting. Excellent, excellent. 21, you'd rather not dox him? Oh, like an actual one, huh? Yeah, probably for the best that you didn't do that. Oh, they're right here. I don't know. Wait, how many... Oh, there goes our traps. I should have shut the door, but. We do have someone that can uh, do planting now, though, so we should be able to get wood much easier. 
soft wooden colonist run has 25 pawns at the moment. <laughs> All right. Close or close. Uh, so let's go ahead and turn you off planting. And you know what? Let's put you up higher on research. So if you're not building something, you're going to be researching now. You can get this done. Just can't help it. You want all of them. It does happen. We often see where it's like, all right, I'm going to do a low pawn count this time. And suddenly it's time to build the ship. We have 35 people. It's like, huh. Let's go, Nez. Welcome in. Community challenge this month. Yeah, I think I'm going to do the community challenge a second time next Sunday. <laughs> the grower is going to go get wood. That's, that's correct. Yeah, I think I will actually do the community challenge a second time. Then it's, uh, it's been a really crazy one. <laughs> you may not like it. This is what low pawn count looks like. I don't think that's true. The speed, you need one for mining, one for cooking, one for research, and so on. I'm an expert, trust me. All right, all right. Major brink on sprinkles. Well, they're upset about the skull spikes too. Look at, look at that. What a snob. What a snob. Stream. Hey, how's it going? Tax evasion. Oh, good. Uh, five percent is harder than losing is fun. Losing is fun is two hundred twenty percent. Here, I'll show you. It's not speed. If you go to options and you go to gameplay, um, losing is fun is two hundred twenty. This is five hundred percent. So it's over twice as high of raid scaling as losing is fun. Yeah. Difficulty modifier. Nothing to do with speed. Yeah. Look at that. A full row of traps. First time forever. Smoke leave withdrawal here. Just make the barracks more impressive. Okay, let me check something here. Conversion is 58%. Uh, let's get room impressiveness up a little bit higher. Oops. And then I think we'll try that and see how it goes. This winning sucks. It's not a loss since biotech. It's crazy. I feel like I'll probably lose one of these RNG runs, but so far we've eaten every single run since biotech came out, which is nuts. Nuts, nuts, nuts. Lost to a dark spot in your base and bugs dug into your base. That can happen for sure. Beware of the overhead mountain. Praying cannabis instead of having a rug. It's a flame around, watching and playing at the same time. That's right. You're min maxing. What's that? Very impressive. I think I'm just going to pull the trigger here. We can finish off the conversion. All right, 61%. Let's just go. Down to 9.2. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. Research finally almost done. We already have the blocks that we're going to need for it. Um, Go ahead and start working on getting those as well. We're connected, I guess. Wood. Miracle. That's why I lost the traders this time, too. Man, Randy has been pretty active. Look at that. Three events right in a row. Look at that drop. Oh, man. It's going, Doug. Welcome in. Down to 0.75%. He resents it. Yeah, well.
Uh, we are going to need more steel after that, too. Planning able to use the Anima Tree. I, had, I didn't start Tribal. Uh, Sprinkles is a Tribal recruit, so we could technically use the Anima Tree with Sprinkles, but um, I haven't decided if I'm going to yet or not. Maybe. Maybe. Think about it. Mushroom spoil and yeah, 30 days. They actually spoil faster than uh faster than rice or corn. Rice is 40 days and corn is 60. But mushrooms are only 30. So we'll eventually have that as an actual cooler. Right now, that's actually cool enough in there for over half the year, but yeah, we will eventually have to chill our shrooms. Research almost done. Finally. Finally, finally. Uh, let's turn that off as a gather spot. Okay. Actually getting some stuff done. Well. Corey just passed the year mark, too. So behind from all those deaths. Actually, build usable tanks and such. You cannot know. No, those are just added to the map when ideology came out. Random map junk, yeah. But uh, there are mods, of course. You can you can build just about anything with mods. Inversion, hooray! Excellent, excellent, excellent. Yeah, like all the cars and stuff, yeah. It's just lore, I guess. Lore. Oh my god, we're almost there. Early soil, I'm wondering how you got oddly shaped a red mountain room for the fungal gravel. So, you know, I could put fungal gravel in that little corner. Oh, no, no, it's under... Uh, <laughs> you actually, you actually tricked me. I was like, there is an overhead mountain there. No, obviously not. I didn't dig that. No. <laughs> Sometimes you get little ones like that, though. It's really weird when that happens. When you have, like, a single overhead mountain spot. What is this? It's a giant spire. It's like a one foot by one foot spire into the sky. That's what a spire is. Uh, we'll use that rich soil to grow some other things on the next growing season, but for now we are just growing our little mushrooms and surviving. Oh my god, finally. Finally the research. All right. I'm probably going to make that its own room to grow more down there during the grow season. It'd be great to try that out at some point. Um, for now, though, I think I'm just going to box it in. Yeah. Well, it takes very little material to do it. And then uh, we'll, uh, we'll expand on that later on. When we need to. So don't roof that. Okay. Single square, you cannot paint. Ugh. You know what? I remember when the paint came out and uh, I was upset that you can't paint some things like the spaceship. You can't paint the spaceship? That should definitely be something that you can paint. I want to paint my spaceship red so it goes faster. This is bullcrap. Take on the no pause mod makes the game easier because the fourth speed allows more things to be done for the event timer that is tied to real time. But there is no event timer tied to real time. <laughs> so 
So that would be true if that was the thing, but it's not. So an orc. Go face. Go face. Yeah, there's no real time event timer. It's all in game stuff is all based on in game hours and in game days and in game seasons. Orc reference. Uh, I love summon Sky God. Mammoth 2191. Is this an 11 and a half inch snake or a 12 inch snake? That doesn't seem like a commandment, Sky God. It seems like a question. All right. All right. Here we go. So we need someone that can mine. We still need a crafter. I mean, they have level six, so it's not super terrible, but. Great either. Greats. Uh Tally have a three. Alright, well they're gonna do a little bit of mining. Get this done. Pod mic. Another sky gun. Alright, let's see what this one says. Mammoth 3153. No other orcs will sleep with him unless they put a bag over his head. I think I clicked plant cutting. These are marked. Oh, you mean on their. Uh... Oh, thank you. I thought you, uh, you meant I had mar marked plants over here instead of mining. I was like, oh my god. We're doing it. Production. Stove. Much better commitment. Shadow of Mordor and Shadow of War were both super good games, yeah. Had a lot of fun with those. A lot of fun. It's really silly that the uh, Nemesis system is like trademarked or copyrighted or whatever, all those things. It's all the things. So, like, only Warner Brother games can use it. put out more games with it. Are they doing like a Wonder Woman game with it or something as well? I think so. Warner is really pretty worried about these developers and designers really ready to work. Yeah, yeah, it's such an awesome system. It feels so fun to play it. Like ima imagine a lot of like open world RPGs like that with the Nemesis system. Really awesome system. Do you like Shadow of Mordor better? I'm not sure which one. They were both really good, yeah. I played them, both of them, several years after they had been out, so. I know uh, Shadow of War got a lot of crap when it first came out because of, like, microtransaction stuff, but all that had been removed and fixed by the time I played it, so, fortunately. I didn't have to... I didn't have to worry about that. I'm gonna get another uh, event here. And let's change this to colonist and get a vent there. Same, you never even heard about that? Yeah, I, there were, apparently when Shadow War first came out, it had, it had uh, loot boxes like. Uh, Real money loot boxes in single player RPG game. And uh, I got a lot of crap for it. Good reason. And luckily, they actually listened and changed it. So, uh, the plague. Uh, we still don't have a good doctor, right? So, this could also be deadly. 
like uh, Anzer. Anzer is not what I would consider a good doctor. The kid got it as well. So we have Preach Health. So we need to keep an eye on both of these and see which one of them is pulling through and which one is it. 28% tin quality with industrial medicine. Ooh. That's brutal. The kid is Welcome very back. likely to die. Should probably use it on them. Greatly appreciated. Should use it. All right, we'll see what happens. Ugh. Yeah, isn't that crazy? Yeah, but I guess they fixed it all. What's the best mech for melee? If you're doing just melee combat, uh, Scyther is really good because they rebalance it a little bit. But Scyther is very worthwhile for the amount of damage and combat power you get compared to how many raid points each Scyther gets you. So Scythers are really good, yeah. And they're they're quick. So good overall. Uh, Tic Tac Totemic. They were the four months. Thank you, Tic Tac. Thank you, thank you. Hopefully they survived the Black Death. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> Let's go on, Harry. Yeah. It's gonna be a rough one. It's gonna be a rough one. Oh, I was already do supposed to do the split. So we'll uh, we'll see if they survive, and then uh, we'll do the split after that. Okay, next step is we're gonna get some gift subs. From Bean Man. Bean Man, thank you for the five gift subs. Thank you, Bean Man. Very much appreciated as well. Go, just barely. Thank you, Bean Man. I appreciate it. All right. All right. Tunnelers are able to work at deep drills? Yeah, yeah, tunnelers can do deep drills. In fact, they get extra resources from uh, from all mining. Yeah. What are we splitting today? Today is the release, well, it released a couple days ago, of uh, yet another zombie survival game. One of the games I played on uh, Steam Next Fest, like three or four Next Fests ago, I actually really liked. Hey, child. Man, they might still die. We need a good tend. It's probably not going to happen. Like, we just don't have a good doctor. Oh, man. Oh, that would suck. I mean, Preach Health is barely letting them catch up. All right. Well, we got to hope for a good tend. Come on, Anzer. Anzer, we need like a uh, 70%. Yeah, I'm going to be playing it here in just a little bit. It's kind of, it's the same genre as Vampire Survivors, yeah. Thirty-seven. Oh man. He might be dead. Reach health is gonna run out. Uh no, it's explanation memes. Explanation memes. Explanation memes. I didn't realize that it still existed. What are you AMAing? Here, let me disable the meme one. There you go. Explanation memes will work. Oh, it's already getting to cold season. Crap. Well, that's not good. Uh, can't really afford the heaters yet, so. Make these. We can get more wood. It's fine. Ooh, it's cold season already. Man, oh man. Probably it's fine. Just yeah, just look through it or like use the ice into something else first and check in case that's where it came from. 
the bow girl started off thinking is the weakest. Oh yeah, and then she was annihilating everything. Yeah, and every build that we did as well. There goes priest health. Intend to get in one hour. All right. All right, Anzer. Here we go. Come on, get like a 50. A 50, not even a 70. Just a 50, Anzer. You can do this. Think of the number 5 and 0. Don't do a 5 or a 0. Or a 0 0.5. 47. That was pretty close. Pretty close. Man, that might be enough. The thing is, the plague is going to start catching up now that Preach Health is gone. Combat Supplier. Alright, uh, while that's happening, let's go ahead and set uh, to mine these. Did we find the bug? Yeah, we found the bug. We were able to recreate it, and it's been reported to the developers. So, yeah, it was a bug uh, for sure. And uh, we mentioned it in the Discord as well and gave the details in there. So They're combat suppliers, so I don't think they're going to have any Glitter World or anything like that. I mean, we can check them, but I don't think... don't think so. Do we have any normal medicine left? Um, don't. So we might as well get that. I don't even know if we're gonna get another 10 in in time. I think they're going to beat it just barely. Yeah, it's staying even as far as which one's a raisin, so I think I think they're going to make it. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, they're good. They're good. Close one. The kid made it. Way to go, kid. Way to go. Way to go, child. <laughs> okay. Uh, we're just gonna keep with those right now. And I need to get. Uh, I need to get guns. I need to get everyone guns. So now we just need to kind of chill. I could make this so we don't have to plant in there as much. Uh, by going ahead and mining of steel to get the switched over. I might go ahead and do that. Pretty easy one to do. Level 3 art. Mm. Yeah, maybe. 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 I'm concerned for an unwanted child. We didn't initially want them. Now they're fine. They're now a growing on us child. Uh, so I need to switch over to the split stream. I was supposed to already do that. I think that's a pretty good spot right there. And we'll be back to this uh, for sure, though. Not today. Welcome back. Dead Most roach at the bottom. <laughs> Dead roach would be better for you to swallow than a screw. <laughs> Uh, Shin, thank you for the 11 months. Thank you, Shinir. Anniversary soon. Almost that full calendar year. All right, that was a very active first episode of this uh, RimWorld 5% no pause RNG run. Uh, the stream is not over. The stream will continue. But I'm going to split over and play another game for a couple hours. Um, and then this this will continue. This will continue. So let me save it for anything else happens. But man, what a what turmoil. We almost lost this run. As close as I've been to losing a run probably in a long time. So our goals when I get back are going to be to get to uh, guns and mortars. 
kind of sit tight, wait for some, uh, wait for some good pawns. And as long as we can keep the child growing and the planter happy, I think we can survive long enough to get to a good stabilization point.